Yeah, because people about, say instead of saying a diet, you're supposed to be making a lifestyle change. Yeah, because yeah. diet can sound like ill. No. <sighs> That's me, that. That's what we're supposed to be me tomorrow. Lifestyle change. Really? You starting your lifestyle change tomorrow? Girl, every morning I'll be ordering Chick fil A uh, breakfast. Girl, Chick fil A breakfast? I love your breakfast. Chick fil A oh No. I'd be like, Spike, you hungry? He'd be like, yep, order our uh, order our favorite. I'm weak. You gotta get a biscuit with extra butter and honey packs. I'm weak. Yeah, he loves a biscuit. Lifestyle change. He loves a biscuit. <laughs> that, when it come with, it's like a sausage one, but I'd be adding bacon to his. And if you want, still good. Wait, bacon and sausage? Yes. I love pork. And they be like, pork stop your heart. But we all gonna die anyway. Pork is good. <laughs> Damn, I pork is good. It's crazy. What's <laughs> popping, y'all? Oh, my God. What's up, y'all? Pregnant? Yes, y'all. Yes, sis. Y'all didn't see the memo. Y'all didn't get the memo. Thank you. Thank you. I got y'all fave. They be loving me in QIA. They be like, damn, nobody. Y'all remember we did a big chop on her. So y'all gonna see her little hair growth journey on this channel. She actually said she wore her hair natural too. I'm proud of you. I didn't think you was gonna wear it natural. You gave me like you was gonna be in braids and like right when you take it down, you was gonna have an appointment. I really felt that. Like I really wanted to. And my mom was like, No, you don't wear your hair out. And I was like, No. All she wanna do is play in my head. Why? <laughs> I was like, Stop, she like doing my hair. But mm -mm, no. So what'd you put in it? You just wet it, you did like a wash and go. Yeah. I'm so I put this little mousse in it. And then, like, I didn't want to comb it out the blow dryer because it didn't want to come in hot light. So I just like blow dry it like that. It was, Can I change your caption cool. on Instagram to Panda Plus too? Why? Because I didn't like how you said round two. I think you should have put Panda Plus too, like somebody just said. I was thinking that too. She should have put uh, that. I could change it. Change my caption after everybody already seen it. Already just seen it. It's okay. Posted. When I go back to it, they're going to be like Panda Plus Dos. Yeah. Panda Dose. No, bitch. Pana, no. Panda Dos. No. Pena plus dos. No. <laughs> plus dos. Oh. Amani, here we go. Amani <laughs> rejecting my native tongue again. Girl. She does not like when I speak in Spanish. She don't speak Spanish. I'm going to say, I thought you didn't really even know Spanish. Ah, Y'all, so I changed my vlogging channel to BTS Panda, like behind the scenes Panda, because you know, this is like me and then my vlogging channel is like behind the scenes because it's not Panda Plus 1 anymore. Like, I have another kid in my belly. Panda Plus 2. So you just can't do that. I don't know what it is. Then I'm going to have to change it. Panda Plus 3, Panda Plus 6. You having more kids? Nah, you right. Just do Panda and her kids. Panda and her kids is telling like Because you don't know Panda's what I'm going to Panda's caravan. I think you do Panda Plus 2. The Jeep is full. I don't know. BTS Panda, it's just not even sitting right with me, friend. You've been saying that since I changed I don't know it. About you ain't BTS, feeling that? No, I don't feel BTS Panda because BTS Panda is not get, is not doing nothing to me. But Panda, Panda Plus 2 is hella cute. Really? Yes. What y'all think in the chat? BTS Panda or Panda Plus 2? Not Panda and them. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who got it? Is there, Panda a is there a moderator in here? Do a poll. Panda Plus 2 or BTS. I don't think they could do polls on here like that. Yeah, they can. Not panning them. I kind of like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> we used to do polls in here all the she time. She ain't panning her badass kids. They it's bad. Not, it's not like this baby ain't even born and I know this baby bad. Because <laughs> this baby in there doing too much already. So it's going to be born at the end of the year, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, y'all. I'm, I'm probably going to end up scheduling a C-section. I haven't really came to a full conclusion. Um. So... If I do that, my due date will be probably around September twenty something. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to get out of Virgo season before I do that. Panda plus two, come on, cool. yes. What? Panna, baby, BTS Panda is not Panna gay. Panda children. That's like a church lady. Fine, I'll change it to Panda plus two. I'm not gonna yes. keep changing it. That's all you, you need to keep it as Panda plus two. You want a boy or a girl? You know, I really don't mind either. I think it would be nice to have a girl just to have the best of both worlds. But I'm thinking. really nervous about. Yeah, I think a girl. she having a girl. She doesn't know yet. At least you already know how to do hair. Like, it's not even the hair. It's just life. Like just seeing her. You know what a girl. lot of people say is like when they have a daughter, like you like complain about your daughter and stuff. And when you complain about her to your mom, your mom be like, "That's what I was going through with you." It's just another thing to you. Oh, your attitude, your this, your that. Yeah, it's and if she, got, she, if she got one with an attitude, she finna go crazy. <laughs> yeah. She finna be like, who? Because who was you talking to? <laughs> no, what are you God. Doing? 
I'm using this as a rubber band for her hair. Yeah, the cool thing about scheduling a C-section is if you don't want a certain zodiac day, like, okay, you come in the 21st, the 22nd, or 23rd, that's when you do your hair. Yeah. Or you come in the 23rd, so you have a different zodiac. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, to be birthday. honest, I don't really care. I only know two Libras, so I don't really care for Libras either. Girl, Technically, no. my due date is uh, October 2nd. But like I said, I don't, I, I'm really nervous about going full term, y'all, because I went full term with Kai and it didn't really end up well. I was pretty much almost 40 weeks and I almost gave birth to a stillborn. So mm-hmm. I don't, I'm not really feeling the going, you know, 40 weeks. And if they schedule a C-section, I heard that they do it usually at like 38, 38 39 weeks. Yeah. weeks. So, you know, I ain't really feeling that. So the 40 weeks will be October 2nd. Yes. Okay, so it'll come But, out, it'll come you out. know, or, you know, if I go into labor naturally, that would also be my belly button going away. Is it? Yes, it's opening up. Oh, my God. Wait, is my belly button going away? Hold on, wait. No, I just ate food. What? Nothing. I don't know. It felt like it was growing instantly. Um, <laughs> I was about to say, Um, yeah, so hopefully, you know. Yeah. But y'all, oh, my God. Like, I just, I don't know. I need. I'm pissed, I don't my, know. Bro, I'm pissed my daughter gonna get. Ooh, fuck, PJ. At Aries? Prayers to you. He said Aries? Yes. Yes, that's me. No. Oh. But Aries women is not it. Aries Real boss. It. You know who else is an Aries? Ooh, somebody the else. Little Mermaid. Is she really? Hallie Bailey. Hallie Bailey, yes. She don't give me She's Aries. She's so nice. She do not give me Aries. <laughs> I'm not so nice. What the fuck? I give you you are too. You, you, you not. You you cool. The typical Aries. My, like you're nice like, to me. The typical Aries is. Uh, who the hell am I mean to? No, yeah, I don't know. Haley Bailey just seems like more of like hold back than like you. She like, don't give me no to. damn Aries. Yeah, she gives like really. Oh, I'm not gonna say it. She give me cancer. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna say it. That's what I'm saying. She's not gonna say it. You gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. I only think about you that be pissing me off. You just be hella impatient. I be like, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't have no patience. I don't. I don't. I don't. She's like, it's okay. Let me just do it. No, just chill out. It's just like no, because it's like I'm the type of person like. When I be like, oh, can you pass me this? I actually mean like, if you got something in your hand, I want you to do this. Like I want you to drop what you're doing, and literally I want you to do what I want you to do immediately. Two seconds go by. It's it's okay. Don't worry about it. Like what? Yes, it's like when I say jump, I want you to already be in the air. (laughs) That's what it's giving. I really don't have jumping yesterday. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. So July twelfth. BTS Panda is crazy. Are my people that say Panda Plus too? Come on now. Y'all are logical like me. BTS Panda is not given. Because what the fuck is BTS? It's not a group. That's, that's the K-pop oh, wait, group. Oh, wait. That's a K-pop group. That's why they said it's not like a K-pop group. No, we don't want that bull okay, crap. y'all eat me head. Damn, I'm pregnant. Is that what y'all gonna do? <laughs> yes. It's, wow. Wow. Disrespecting a pregnant woman in her first trimester when she's sick. During uh, women's health. And it's trying to women's women's health. Care, but I can't even keep my hands steady because I'm just <laughs> feeling fatigued. Feeling fatigued is crazy. You should just let me do it like this and flip it up. Yes, it could be like all sleep back with a flip at the bottom. Mm, that's giving old lady. I'm not a fan. Remember you said you're gonna wear your grandma wigs. <laughs> <laughs> I should have, but they um my granny wigs a little too synthetic for me. Synthetic. Not yeah. too much on grandma. Now she's gonna be itching. Yeah, no. I'm so weak. I like BTS Panda. I like Panda Plus Two. Panda Plus Two is a lot of words in my name. Panda plus two? That's like that's two not words. Bad. Panda plus one. It was Panda plus one, but she got two now and she done at that. So Panda plus two. No, she done the thing that. about BTS Panda, you can always keep it saying no matter how many kids you have. If it's Panda plus two is then it's what if it's Panda plus three and it goes Panda plus no, two? No, she no, 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 I'm done. I know my friend. She done. So Panda Plus, Panda Plus Two is cute, okay. and, it, and it stays with the peas. Panda Plus. Did you spit? Was <laughs> so two. that shit is so cute to me. Why you just put a pea in front of two? Cause it ain't no pea in there. Panda Plus <laughs> Poo. <laughs> shit, you my can't ch- be done. Oh. My channel name gonna be Need a Cigarette, cause that's what it's really gonna be giving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you gonna have two toddlers. That's exciting. Keep pass me the ciggy. <laughs> oh. Keep BTS kind of free that Instagram shit. Even then, even then, I feel like it shouldn't be on your Instagram. I feel like you should. Wait, be like when I name. first changed it, y'all. So the real reason why I changed my Instagram is because 
my hair page was called braided up and i mean i had did that a long time ago like before i was like i mean i was popping but i already had the no fast fan page but i had just changed it into that because like you know, my nickname is Bray. People call me Bray, so it's like braided up. Yeah. But then it's like, it's kind of hard because I feel like when people look up Dope Ass Panda, like, I think that they expect a hair page, right? Mm -hmm. So that's why I changed my hair page to Dope Ass Panda. And um, that's why I changed my personal to BTS Panda because it's like the behind the scenes. This is like my personal page. Mm -hmm. And I never really post on Dope Ass Panda, but I feel like you want to keep like all your uh, social medias like in sync, you know, mm -hmm. like on Dope Ass Panda on tiktok instagram so are you, you ever, saying? are you ever gonna do something with braided up or that's kind of like over i feel like i don't know i thought i was thinking like maybe i should keep the name but i don't know i don't know i don't know but um where was where was i going with this why was i talking about that we were talking about why you changed oh but name. literally as soon as i changed it Amani was hella irritated she was like where the fuck is your page at and who is this bts what is that? Because I just hate that shit. And my other friend Laura did the same thing. She's like, bitch, where is your Instagram? I'm like, it's under BCS Panda. What is that? Yeah, what the it's, fuck is that? It's my new identity. No, we don't want that dirty <laughs> ass yeah. shit. <laughs> yeah, but it's like behind the scenes. No. The more you keep explaining it. Dre doesn't know yet, y'all. That's why he wasn't in the uh, reveal video. Dre, <laughs> <Ray>, please. <laughs> what? So we found out before the daddy? Yes. That is crazy. Yeah, I know know I'm still trying to figure out how to tell him. Just hand him the ultrasound picture and start blushing and crying. Blushing, blushing and crying? crying. Crazy. That's how they do in the movies. <laughs> and he's supposed to get up and start weak. jumping and celebrating. I'm so weak. Thank you, y'all. How did you? How, you? how long you with these? Uh, I don't know, just regular like. Okay. If you ever open up your own song, you should name it Braid It Up. Yeah, I would do that. That would be cool. Braid It Up by Dope Ass Fanta? No, see here, you go add an extra <laughs> shit. That's a mouthful. <laughs> well, your name here is Braid It Up, so. Yeah, yeah these are just play. Look at my ankles. My ankles actually didn't have these. But I had these since like seventh grade. Man, what grade are you in now? Twelve. <laughs> That's not that long. That's too long. That's I was five like years. five feet in seventh grade. Maybe four feet something. Mm -mm. You can be done after a third. No, she no, done after a No, no, guys, no. Three kids This is baby, much. when I tell you this baby is tearing my ass up, it's I'm harder than the done. first one? Way harder. Oh, wow. Way harder. You this ain't no girl. joke. This ain't no joke. This definitely No, this ain't no yeah, joke. That's gonna be a girl. She giving it to you already. <laughs> this ain't no joke. This ain't no joke. This ain't no joke. She better come out looking like Lori Harvey the way she cutting up. <laughs> Baby, if her parents ain't giving that, she's not. <laughs> Y'all think I look a little bit mm. from the head up? Mm. <laughs> I think I like Do this I need to pucker my lips to look more okay, like Okay, okay, shut up, shut up. <laughs> when you do your intro, can you put that as like, can you put that in there? I no. think I like this <laughs> little if, if you sing it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I sing it because I know that's kind of No copyright. copyright. If, I think I like this. It's like, really like boom, Panda Plus 2. And then it goes straight into your vlogs. I think I like they this. They are so <laughs> I just like her. See? Okay. Wait, let's do it together. One, two, three. I, I think, think I like, like this little lad. Yes. Okay, so, okay, so we're going to record that and that's going to be your intro. Yeah. And it's going to say Panda Plus 2. Mm hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Surprise. Go straight into it. <sighs> if, we, if you don't do that, I'm not fucking with you. No more. Mm -hmm. And I'm unfollowing you and unsubscribing to all your shit. <laughs> Damn. You know some pregnant people be craving stuff that they can't eat, like washing powder and stuff? Yeah, that's, I forgot what that's called. It's a, that's a special syndrome. I be craving washing powder just because it smells good. It what? Looks like it good. <laughs> what? Like cornstarch and powdery ice. You be eating no, cornstarch? Powdery no, ice? No, cornstarch is, is nasty, but it looked like it tastes good. But I had it, oh, it was nasty. What? Oh my God. No, I taste the cornstarch too. Cause I wanted to see why people like it. Hot, it's yeah. just nasty. And then it, it gets but I ain't gonna lie, I fried my know. chicken in it, y'all. That shit was crispy as oh, yeah, crunchy as chicken crispy. I didn't ever had. Yeah. It's probably a girl because I've been sick since day one. Also, Sherelle, girl. It don't make Place no sense. Place your best, y'all. What y'all think? I'm eating these braids up. I don't need to do not a near another damn row. Well, the way I'm eating only these. Two braids in. Um, <laughs> 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 I said, uh. Ma'am. Shit. 
around eating these braids up. It don't make no sense. And your kids gonna be able to go to the same school in middle school, elementary school, and high school. <sighs> Saying kids with an S on the end for me is just, it's just crazy, right? It's sick, y'all. I don't know. Y'all, like I met Bri like 10 years ago, and now she got two kids and she's married. <laughs> <laughs> when I met you, you were with Dre, right? Yeah. I hope yeah. so. Shit. <laughs> look, look. Was it the nigga with the credit? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> nah, I've been with Dre, girl. I feel like all my life shit. Mm-hmm. Dre, if you see this. <laughs> if you see this. Shit. Yeah, y'all. I did say this was my Kobe year, but I didn't mean like this, though. Baby. Baby. I just remember sitting here and looking at that pregnancy test. Like, oh my god! So that was the same day, right? Maybe yes. it, was, it was a week. It was that Sun. No, it was a couple weeks after Kai's birthday party. So that's what I'm saying. It was the same day I, after my sister got her hair did and we left, and she was like, "I think, guys." I'm like, "What?" You know what? Okay, so 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 y'all, let me tell y'all the story and how I found out. Because prior to me knowing, like. I just kept, like, you know how you joke and you be like, girl, I feel like I'm pregnant. Because I was feeling, like, a little sick and stuff, but not really. Like, you know how you just be joking around? Yeah. I was honestly just joking around until I was having a conversation with Imani. And I was saying something to her. And I was like, girl, you on your period. She was like, girl, my period been gone. <laughs> and I was like, what? Because me and Imani get our shit at the same time. As soon as Imani starts, my shit comes. And so I was like, wait, what? She was like, yeah, it's been done for like four days. Yeah. Bitch, I started staring at her like, bitch, what? Huh? No, you was like, no, 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 it's not. And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. bitch, I'm not on that shit no more. <laughs> she was like, I've been done. Then I looked at the date. I literally will not forget. It was January 28th. I was yeah. like, bitch, not the month is almost over. Damani was like, the month is done, bitch. Yeah, because you, like, yeah, you had like a day or two left. You got your flow period tracker out? I don't track that shit. I only did that with Kai, to be honest, because, like, but I feel like um, the day before my menstrual cycle is coming, I can usually feel it coming. Mm -hmm. Like, can't you? Like, you get that icky feeling. Yeah, and then I just start, uh, I just start wearing a panty liner until it starts, and then, boom. But, y'all, me and Imani and Niobe was here. I was like, maybe we should walk to CVS. Bitch. And the whole time, Imani's like, you really think you are? I'm like, no, not really. But, like, we could just take the test, y'all. That shit lit up like a Christmas tree. When I say that shit, that's the results came quicker oh, than the fucking test said, said it would come. Usually, if you like, it takes three minutes. That shit came in 30 seconds. Oh, wow. That shit said, ding, ding, ding. No, I literally opened the door. I was like, Madam Body. I was, I just stared at her. She was like, No, bitch, you're lying. Girl. And don't I get said, me wrong. I'm not lying. She was planning to get pregnant this year, just not January. <laughs> so like, soon. God, God damn. Was gonna start. Fuck. <laughs> I planned on trying this year. I didn't necessarily want it to happen this, this year. year. <laughs> yeah, like. I was gonna start trying though, but like I wasn't really trying. But they say it's hella easy to get pregnant after you have a baby. Yeah, you that first year, like really first. Who was you, they? And they didn't say that to me. Bitch, oh. Everybody knows that. That's why people be. You see, that's like uh, G Herbo baby mama had a baby mm-hmm. right after. You're real fertile after having babies and real fertile after birth. But girl. it had been a year, guys. I didn't just have a baby. But you was still in postpartum. That means you were still real fertile. Yeah. So. When postpartum then. Girl, no, you don't know. Up to three you years wouldn't know because you're still that. in prepartum now. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, you ain't really got that your break yet. That's how quick mine showed up as soon as I placed it down. The line's popped up. Me too. That's Me insane. Too. That, it's Me like too. the test has been waiting for you to take it. Exactly. The test said about time, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I just. I think you like this little life, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was just a theme song, bitch. I think I need a cup of wine. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's really given. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with my life, y'all. I know y'all ain't talking about no dirty ass Aries talking about, yes, we are very loyal and trustworthy people. We are the best friend and family you could ever have. Bullshit. Dre wasn't shooting it up, to be honest. He shot one blank, but I guess it wasn't a blank. Yeah, it wasn't. Right, so. <laughs> Congratulations on your Literally, y'all, one blank. time. I'm hella serious. Breathe. It was not one time. Stop lying to these people. Okay, like two. No, it was not. No, I swear, I swear. It was two times. You could ask Dre. It was like twice. Wait, but you did say that. He was like, I only did it one time. I said, that's all it takes. <laughs> like, what? No, for real. It was at the most two times. Like, I don't even play like that. I don't even play like that. I know this girl who got pregnant when she lost her virginity. Damn. No. Unfortunate. No, I never knew no. again. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> How do you even know if it was good? You had to do it with a sick people. I hate Neek. I, I cry and find the nearest staircase. 
Huh? Nick said, I'd cry and find the nearest staircase. <laughs> so fall down on the You is room. going to hell. Um, yes, to uh, exercise? Monisha, that is not. Okay. Aries are not it. The only Aries that's somewhat it is Brie. I would not have no other Aries friend. Like, I wouldn't have another Leo friend. Not you, friend. Not you, not you, not you, not you. <laughs> F both of them, okay? It's the fire um, signs. It's just I think much. ever since I got pregnant, I braid better. Can you shut the fuck up? Like, <laughs> no, it's for real. For real. She be pissing you me think off. You, you focus in more? Yeah, I'm locked in. No, really? you're about to piss me off. Yes, I'm Talk about how in. would you feel if it turned out to be twins, Oh. Wait. <laughs> no, it's not twins. I, I wait, wait, wait. Very we, had this, we had this conversation today, and somebody, people keep saying on the little video she posted that it looked like it's two sacks in there. Oh. It is two sacks. A ball sack and a... <laughs> and, a and she uh, said twins run in her family, y'all. She's gonna have twins. They do run in my family, but I already... Damn, I, damn, I, damn, I damn. damn. Okay, don't... Twins. Don't change it to Panda Plus 2, because we don't fucking know That's yet. That's what I'm <laughs> Fuck. Okay, and the plus two plus one accidentally. <laughs> Buy one, get one free. At this point, <laughs> at this point, it's Panda and them. Panda plus, Panda plus Bogo. <laughs> uh, buy one, get one. Can you pass me a clip? Please. Oh my God. I would have been got it myself. Thank you. I hate this too. Okay. Okay. You said I was like, impatient. Thank you, PJ. PJ, I'm single if you wanted to talk to me. No, he's having a baby and he said he ain't, he don't want you no more. He batched himself. He said that him and his baby mama just having a baby. That don't mean they're together. <laughs> just having a baby. What? Just having a baby. This he said that she wanted a baby, so he gave it to her. Oh. That's it. What? Is that easy, PJ? I, mm, mm, fuck I'm sorry. That's what I was about to say. I won't want to. I'm my life up. <laughs> not I won't want to. I'm with Neek. Find the nearest staircase. You can not mine. Baby, <laughs> I don't want none of that baby back shit. No. It did look like two sacks. She gonna love this little life. Cause this Why y'all always looking at my BDDs? Actually, I'm pregnant now, so I got an excuse. No, baby. Oh, my God. <laughs> I was so happy for you to be like, for you to not say it is you postpartum no more. But, bitch, you got pregnant the same yeah, month. No, I didn't do my hair today because I was really sick this morning. My intention was, but I just can't. So, you mean, like, throwing up or just nauseous? Mainly just I nauseous. Twins. I found out at 10 weeks. Funny thing. Was I had an ultrasound eight weeks and it was one baby. Ooh. Went back at ten and it was two babies. So you never know. <laughs> Bitch, you having twins. Bitch, you having twins. <laughs> Bitch, did you just hit a pregnant woman? <laughs> you know that that's that's, a, that's considered assault. I hope you know that. It's called um, battery because you actually did it, Bookie. Sometimes people assault get pregnant with twins about it. and then, then one, one baby eats really? the other baby. Yep. So, so if I say I'm gonna slap the shit out of you, that's only assault. But that's if assault. I actually slap the when shit out of you, when you actually do it, it's battery, Bookie. Yeah. So when they say assault and battery, it's because I said I'm gonna slap the shit out of you. And you did it. Yeah. And you stood on business and did it. <laughs> Learned that in school, baby. I learned, that's the only thing I know in school, though. That's crazy. That's you can get in trouble for a thread. Yeah, you can. <laughs> baby, you really trying to have twins? I'll no, I'm not. Funny. And you need to stop saying that. I love that for you. No, <laughs> don't. <laughs> I just love it. It can't be two. How far along are you? It can't be two. Um, y'all, to be honest, I, I keep forgetting because, um, I think I'm 11 weeks. I keep forgetting because they changed my date, due date a couple times, mm. but I'm pretty sure I'm 11. I'm somewhere between 10 and 11 weeks. I'm not very far. And pregnant is, pregnancy is 40 But it's so weird, y'all, because the top of my stomach is hella hard, like a pregnant stomach. <laughs> and the bottom is like not as hard. Like I could push it in, push it in, like underneath. Maybe the baby's you know? sitting at the top. Wait, it's not even a baby yet, right? It's like a blob. It's the girl's like the size of a probably a blueberry, blueberry, blueberry. Fuck! Why can't I say that? A blueberry. 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 Yeah, mm. I couldn't get it out. A blueberry. Yeah, I'm not that far. But y'all, like, what people don't realize too is like, first of all, I never really lost hell away with Kai, so I'm already kind of like, you know, mm. my stomach is just rounding out. That's really it. So I always yeah. wonder how like. People, they stomach be like, especially like real skinny people with a flat stomach, they stomach be round and have a bulge out and they only like six weeks. But if the baby only the size of a blueberry, why is your like whole uterus bulging out? I mean, there's still like stuff around the baby. It's kind of strange, but it's fluid and, you know. Yeah. My mom has to have a cesarean with my sister because she was like hanging herself in there. She had the thing wrapped around her neck and her heart rate started going down. So. Mm. Amani single, she used to be my man, my man, my man type. Yeah, she's single. <laughs> she's single. Yeah, so. Yeah. And you sticking with the K theme or you don't know? 
I don't know. To be honest, y'all, if I had a girl, I kind of wanted to name her after SZA. So we were going to do Solana Renee. So okay, that's, um, SZA's good. name is Solana Imani. Mm -hmm. But I kind of don't want to do Solana because I wanted to say, I wanted to be Solana. Dre wants Solana. And I feel like that's ghetto because it's just like, it sounds like Solana. Yeah, Solana sounds like Salami. But yours, like Solana, Solana is pretty. Yeah, so I wanted to be Solana Renee. Mm -hmm. You know, Solana and Kyrie. I don't really want to stick with the K because I don't know. I don't really like. So I thought about Kimora for mm -hmm. a girl. Mm -hmm. Kimora Renee, I like that too. But um, I have a client who I went to uh, hair school with. Mm -hmm. And she named her daughter Kamora, so I was like, I don't want to Kamora is like, cute, take but I like Solana because Solana is more unique and very like pretty. Yeah. Kamora is cute, but Solana is like pretty. Yeah, I cheered with a girl named Soliana. Um, Soliana? Yeah, that was cool, but it was kind of long. Solana is cute though. Yeah, Solana. Yeah, so since his name is Solana Imani. Oh, and then the baby had the same middle name as you, right? Mm-hmm. But my yeah, my middle name is Renee, so that's why I'm like, I'll give the baby my middle name. So yeah, but I don't really, um, I don't know. I'm not really like super set on names. Like I'm just, I'm kind of flexible right now. Like I could want to do that. I could want to change. So mm -hmm, yeah. yeah, I'm not really sure yet. I feel like naming a baby is like crazy because like this thing named for the rest of their life. It's yeah. not naming a dog or something like that. Like it's an actual human. Yeah. <laughs> You really have to think about that. And then, I don't know, you just think about, like, job opportunities, all type of stuff I'd be thinking mm -hmm. about, you know? And then it's like, I want it to be something unique, but, like, not something so unique as ghetto, like, so let me Shiana, like, yeah, baby, like, what? All the Quishas, Quita, all that. No. No, no Quishas. No. no. I follow this couple on TikTok, but they're, they're not black, they're white, and they named their son Midnight Moon. Midnight Moon? His middle name is Moon and his first name is Midnight. Her name is like Jasmine Chowells or something like that. No. And people be taking I don't mind unique levels. names, but Midnight Noon. That's what I'm saying. They, they gotta make sense. I like level. the name Saint. Saint is a nice name. Like Kyrie and Saint. But I feel like when you name your kids Saint, like my best friend name is Angel. How are you gonna tell God what your child is? They're not a saint. They're not Girl. an angel. <laughs> They're actually very bad. Not Angel, but you so. got two felonies. <laughs> you know, that's what I'm saying. They name their kids the worst stuff. Heaven. Heaven, Saint, Angel. But you're acting like you're going straight down the yonder. Yeah, mm. uh -huh, I'm not a... Like, they be cute names, but I'm not going to name my kid Angel and Saint because I feel like just by naming them that, they're going to contradict me. And it's going to be real bad. I ain't going to be no Saint. All my kids going to be... I'm going to be a sinner. Saint going to be the worst one. Stealing out of McDonald's and stuff. Off the little pickup rack from the DoorDash people. No. That sound like you, something you do. Because how that even come to your brain? <laughs> I have friends mm -mm. that do stuff like that. Not like sitting door dash, baby. Chipotle be stupid. If I wasn't no, they so put that shit right on the rack. That's what I'm saying. If I was wasn't so picky, I would just grab a bowl and hope I get lucky. But a lot of times people get stuff on their bowls I don't like, so I just never grab one and go. I always have to pay twenty five to thirty dollars for my food. Chipotle got expensive. Yeah, really bad. What's wrong with her? Twenty five to thirty dollars. But oh, I don't. It, it, now it's like twenty five dollars because I don't get double queso and double meat no more. <laughs> get ready. Double queso and double meat is wild. <laughs> right, double right. queso would that definitely have me doubled over. And then after I get the <laughs> meat, that's way too I put the shredded cheese on top too. Oh baby, that's how you make your bowl creamy. I don't eat sour cream and stuff, so you know. Mm -hmm. And then when I get the large bag of chips and the large drink, it's a little pricey. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is super nice. But I eat it in one sitting. That's <laughs> sick as hell. You know how much food that is? I feel like I can never finish a Chipotle bowl. You can't? No, it's too much food. Oh, wow. <laughs> but, but also, I don't get meat on my bowl because I'm finicky about meat and I don't like Chipotle's meat. Oh. Well, so you so I get a veggie bowl. But if you, that's even more of a reason to eat the whole thing. Because if you don't get meat, you should still be hungry. You eat no. rice, though. I need two yeah, I eat rice. I don't eat, I don't get rice. That's really? Nice. Their rice is hella good to me. Like, I wish I could get a side of rice. It's very good. It's real good. You Sometimes I just get a chicken rice. and rice bowl so I could just eat the rice. The rice white bowl. rice and the pinto beans with the steak, with the queso. Yeah. I, I love beans. beans. I love pinto <laughs> beans, but I get black beans because they're better for you. Damn, that's crazy. I'm not, but my child mother is again. Nah, they say when kids have a biblical religious met damn. They be the baddest, because they do. No, for real. Or PKs be the baddest, preacher's kids. <laughs> yes. They be hella bad. And really sneaky. <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
And they be getting freaky at the church house. That too. Not just pregnancy season, girl. For certain people, it's pregnancy season all the time. I wish pregnancy Everybody was pregnant. What? Maybe I will not be pregnant. I wish pregnancy on you and Neek. Y'all only two people right now. And Sierra too, but Sierra, Sierra she already told me I'm blocked, so I don't even know if she on this live. Cause I, uh, she is. I wish pregnancy on her on TikTok, and she TikTok. she politely dismissed me. <laughs> yes, Panda, when you come to LA, how long are you gonna be out here? Um, you know, I was trying to see if my husband wanted to spend his uh birthday weekend out there. So technically, the 17th through the 19th, but I'm not really sure. But oh, I really do want to do your hair. I've been wanting to do your hair since that? that long time ago when I went to LA, and I think you had reached out, and I, I've been wanting to do it ever since. But who is this? One of um, the subscribers. Does she live in LA? We go way back, like four flats on the Cadillac. What's her favorite color on her birthday? Red. Because uh. <laughs> of her hair. No, because I'm tapped in with her and I know her. That's because of what. Now I really want to know her favorite color. What's her birthday? Right, what's her favorite color? <laughs> her birthday. She was born. Girl, go to hell. Now she was born. <laughs> she was born. She got a birthday. I don't want to just be giving out her government information like that. Anybody, anybody. Mm -hmm. Huh? I could find where anybody live and all their phone numbers on this. Her birthday phone. is Ooh. after the 1st and before the 31st. That's what I'm going to say. I don't want to give out too much. <laughs> I hope it is the 1st, actually, so you could be fucking wrong. Mm. My man, that's not my man calling me. Why your phone vibrate like that? that because I can never her. hear it when it do. No, because she be putting it. Never mind. Oh no! <laughs> Way down your that is neck. Kind of has your pregnancy cravings been different from the last time, or is it still the same? No, it's actually different. So last time I was craving um, strawberries, y'all. This mm. time I ate a whole jar of pickles. I ate three jars of pickles within mm. a week. I'm not playing. I ate Old Bay seasoned pickles. I ate fresh, <laughs> fresh original dill pickles. And I ate original pickle chips. Oh, you want to order pickles? Yes. They're hella fucking good. And my cousin owns a, pick, owns a pickle company. And so, <laughs> yes. And I'm going to text him today. On my way home, I need to pick up some pickles. Because it's been a week. And I bought a, a jar of pickles from Walmart. I was being cheap and got the Walmart brand. And then pickles is hella nasty and soggy. They're not crunchy. Yeah. It's like, I can't do that. I do like the crunch sound from people when people buy them. Oh my God, it's just so good. But the smell. No, my mouth is watering. Like, <laughs> that's just so good. And then I like crunchy grapes. Oh, okay. I oh my God, y'all. I was at Walmart pinching all the grapes. Pinching them? Yes, because I'm like, I need the crunch. Oh my God. If you ever want to get some grapes, <laughs> and you want to be cheap, you got to go. And you know how old people taste test the grapes. You grab a bag of grapes and you act like you're going to taste test okay, you grab a handful. I'm going to tell y'all uh, my friend's birthday. It's uh, May 4th. What? No way. You got it right. You asked what, when the girl's birthday is. You yeah, just read it. Where? You're sick as fuck. No, I don't see it. It's at the top. Uh, she going to do that when it's at the top. She put it? Yeah. yeah. Oh. I didn't know she put it. Ooh, pickles. Abigail, that's nasty. Gotta have them great. Okay, I could agree with grapes and strawberries. I'm not a fan of pickles off the stench. Oh. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna stop being ugly tomorrow. Actually, no, I'm gonna stop being ugly. I'm filming a maintenance vlog on Tuesday, so I, that's when I'm gonna stop being ugly. You done with the mom? Actually, my, my, um, no, I got one more. Oh, you want three rows, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. You um, I'm a, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna stop being ugly because that's part of my maintenance. I might book a hair appointment. Who free? <laughs> Tuesday. For free. Am I famous enough to be doing shit like that? Like, who gonna do my hair Tuesday? Yeah. yeah. Gonna be like, me, me, me. Like, how many DMs you gonna get saying me? Hell of people. Shit, one. It's gonna be Donald. <laughs> <laughs> me, friend. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> That's fucked up. I got you. No. No, thank you. Anybody <laughs> going once? <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> no, just keep posting. Somebody please do my hair. I'm in distress. Money throbbing. Oh my god. Because <laughs> he always be the first person. <laughs> Me. No. No, you got to post anybody but wife snatcher in a little parentheses. So he don't respond. No men. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> why you had to leave the room pj when you leave your baby mama and you ready to be a family with me then you can ask me questions Ooh, pj said he tired of you he said when well, you sticky. ready to apply pressure because i ain't got nobody i'm just pj was applying pressure he don't want to be your sloppy seconds <laughs> now you're trying to double back and get some PJ was my first. Was lonely he was not you was my man my man my man yeah but PJ is taking. he's taking <sighs> well, when mm-hmm. he done playing house, you know where your real home is. He said, he's he, he home. called you Cynthia. Or he's talking about me. He don't want to. Oh, he's talking to Cynthia. Cynthia oh, oh, Cynthia. Yeah. And, oh, Cynthia. <laughs> I feel you, PJ. My husband's baby mama. Wait, what? My husband's baby mama is going to be ha- mad as hell. When we tell when my he, stepson. Wait, my husband's. Oh, yeah. Your husband's baby mama. Like, before. Yeah. Come on, mommy's baby. Wait, baby I'm man. thinking, bitch. I'm thinking in the present. <laughs> on the way. My she's baby mama stepson. is gonna be mad as hell when we tell my stepson. Tell him what? Oh, that she's pregnant. pregnant. Oh, oh the no, baby you mama know they mama. be mad because the baby mamas they be thinking they got one ups when you don't got no kid with the man. Especially she the first baby mama. Oh god, you ain't gonna mm-hmm. hear the end of it. You ain't gonna hear the end. I hope she not the first baby mama. Well, actually, um, is she the first wife or just baby mama? Cynthia, how far along are you? Now, since I announced my pregnancy, everybody want to be pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm the I'm the last one. The trendsetter. Aisha saw me pregnant, then she wanted to post. Now you want to announce now that you see them me having four kids is crazy because I why do y'all think that's She look hella far though. She do. Was that her first time announcing it? Yeah. Aww. I inspired her. That's hella cute. Not the Listen. mother of my child, but I don't want you no more. You played in my face. You did. <laughs> Everybody's <laughs> dumpies in here. <laughs> Damn, I can't get nobody. Oh my God. Should I fire y'all? Yeah, wow. Let's keep the train going. Wow. This bitch out of here. Ooh, That'll be your last break. <laughs> yes. Keep walking. I said I'm sorry. Did you just fart? No, I passed gas. Yes. But- <laughs> Did you just fart? No, I passed gas. No, but wait. It's not she, said, no stink. she said, oh, I'm a little gas. Excuse me. <laughs> she said, fart. It had a little joke Wait, with it. First of all, why did I miss that? Second of all, <laughs> you talking about it's under the cape. So as soon as you get it, I'm going to get a whip. Second of all, my baby's face is probably close to your booty. So you just farted in my baby's face. The baby don't have a face. It's a blueberry. The whole body oh is a face. God. His ex-wife, but she acts like a baby mama. Oh. She only seven weeks. Mm. Is she and the first I was trying one? to tell you in the last slide. The first BM. Oh, snap, Cynthia. Congrats. You right behind me. Oh, my God. Y'all, why do I keep getting dumped? So, like, why did PJ say he don't want me no more? But the last live I was on, he said that we could work it out. So, why are you switching up? Because it's a new year? It's just something about you. This ain't your year, sis. Fuck. Pack it up. You think I need to start over? <laughs> you just need to give up on all your goals this year and just do something else. Fuck. You think Graduate I'm- from nursing school. Oh, please. I think I'm lactating. What? This soon? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Instant lactation. Well, people make milk before they had a baby. Where do they put the milk? Mm-hmm. Stay in the baby. No, it sometimes it, it starts leaking leaks. and hurt. It mm-hmm. leaks. Mm. I don't know, because I didn't produce that much milk. Wow. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> Second time's a charm. Somebody shut this bitch up. <sighs> yeah. That's why it's me or nothing, Cynthia. If she had another kid from someone else, I'd never talk to her again. Oh, you're no. petty. You a cancer. Yeah. Because what? I'm just kidding. I thought I wanted you, but I don't. Right. You think you want the only beef stick she want? Beef stick is I'm crazy. Not <laughs> Beef sticks be good to the little beef jackets. <laughs> they do with the teriyaki flavor. I just hate the stench. Oh my god. They do be stinking. They do be stinking. Like they. Uh, what flavor you get? Sweet and spicy. Well, I tried a little bit of the regular one. It was cool. Um, but I'm really a fan of beef jerky slices. The ten dollar package. What? You know, <laughs> Wait, the what beef, jerky, beef jerky. What? The slices that come in ten dollar package would be hard. I like sweet heat. Oh, yeah, that'd be hitting. Ooh, I'm gonna give me some beef jerky after this. Damn, I gotta get gas. gas. Fuck. You got gas. I gotta get gas. <laughs> you need gas, too? Um, you know, I always need gas, baby. When I go to the gas station, I put $20, just enough to get you where I gotta go. 
I just want to make sure if anybody's still in my car, you can't get nowhere. So you That's how you do empty. it. Right. Leave it on E, baby. And when you go to the gas station and they get you on camera. Arrested, bitch. <laughs> you know, the car going to break down right from where they sold it. So you walk in and you see them on the corner of your car smoking. That's Not in your car smoking is crazy. <laughs> That's sick as well. You better open the top because I don't got time for that. Y'all, I really got to lose this weight because I just can't. No, you, no, no, no. Let's lose it together. Baby, you're pregnant. You're pregnant. You only, you yeah, only, but afterwards, I'm going to go It's on only on going up for you, not me. No, <laughs> after this, I'm going to go on a, an extreme weight journey. Wait. Yeah, I'm not gonna say weight loss because I don't know if I'm gonna be gaining or losing, but I'm gonna be on a journey. <laughs> well, extreme sound bad if it's gaining. No. <laughs> I'm trying to get on my 600 pounds. I seen this dude on there named Sean. He was 900 pounds. He was screaming. I felt so bad. I didn't know a human could be 900 screaming. pounds. That's like a ton. Yes, he was screaming because when they was pushing him in a wheelchair, he said his body was hurting. How you hurting and you ain't walking? You How many people pushed. was pushing him? Like three. Three oh, is crazy. My that God. was all me though. So that's like 300 pounds a person. That's still a lot. So do they have like eating disorders? I don't know. Because like I just don't understand how I you thought, get to 900. I don't know. Eating disorders can mean you eat too much and don't eat enough. So I don't know. I can understand how you get to 300, but 9? I feel like I ain't gonna lie. You know how big I've been getting lately? I can understand getting to 500. If we be a real. <laughs> what? What? It would be too good. But <laughs> no. 500 <laughs> is sick. <laughs> Like, I be wondering how they get in the shower and, like, do they really stink? You 500 pounds. Yes, and they don't get in the shower. You heard Amy. She says she don't shower. She just wipe. Well, what? No, she's yes. very country. Her feet always black. She said, then she said she only took a shower, like, once every couple of years. Yes, and then they Tammy went at the dentist like for 12 years. She brushed her teeth once a week. Tammy got a, um, what is that called? A IUD in that's 12 years old. And then she thinks she's pregnant because she's craving water. I can't remember. Like, it's crazy. But she said she ain't had no intercourse. Wait, can a IUD? Water. Hold on, y'all. It only isn't in there because she's so No, baby. but can't you get I some type of infection? Yeah. She said, my IUD has been there for 12 years. And the, the, the lady was just looking at her like, ugh, girl, you nasty. Oh, my God. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Thinking you're pregnant because you're craving water and you haven't done nothing is crazy. And then after her husband died, her life has been. But she got a new Who husband her. died? Tammy. Shut up, he died? Can't, bro, you haven't watched the season. Caleb died. Wait, how'd he die? He wasn't losing no weight. Man. Wait, how much did he weigh? He was like 500 some, 600 some, but he was really like big. He must have been really short. He had a heart attack? I'm guessing. I don't know. They said that he wasn't responsive. They tried to do all these really short Wait, that's not the baby daddy. That's the baby daddy? Oh, no, that's Amy, baby daddy. Tammy, the big one. That oh, Tammy, Tammy, Tammy. I didn't even know she got married. Yeah, she got married to Caleb. And, you know, I don't wish death on nobody. That sucks. Who had a baby? But she met him in the shopping Amy. center? Amy did. Yes. I, I wish Tammy was not with him. Because he only fetish shop. Fetish aside. Uh, how you say it? Fetish, <laughs> fetishized? She only fed. He only fetishized her. Like, he did not love Tammy. Every time they was interacting, he talking about some sex. Caleb, you can't even do sex. Tammy can't. <laughs> She did it with uh, Jerry and BBW King. She didn't do it with Kayla. Wait, how old is her baby? Amy got like a three-year-old and like a one-year-old. Congrats, honey. Two bundles of joy. The ups and downs. The ins and outs. Parenthood. Mm. The ins and outs. Oh. Mm. I'm cool with the ins. I don't know about the outs. <laughs> yeah, they're like, oh, there'll be ups and downs. No. No. No <laughs> downs. <laughs> ain't no downs. Shit. Whippings. <laughs> I'm gonna be handing out whippings like fucking snickers. Whippings sounds really bad. I think whoopings is a better term. Whippings yeah, just like sounds terrible. Did I say whippings? R worded. I'm gonna yeah. say whippings. <laughs> I'm gonna be handing out them whippings. I'm gonna be handing out pops like <laughs> fucking smarties. You gotta make them stand in the corner on one foot. That's crazy. What? Yes. I'm not gonna psychologically torture my, my kids. grandpa. But that's they they old. They back in the day. My grandpa mom, who like a hundred, she did. She used to make them. <laughs> what? <laughs> My name was Granny Lusty. She used to make them stand in the corner, and when they dropped they push, she used to whack them, and I feel so bad. He used to tell that story. He was laughing, but I knew he was really traumatized. <laughs> Cynthia, is this your first baby? Poor granddaddy. I'm ready for my eight week appointment because I'm hoping to finally see our baby in here to heart me. Oh. That really is a special moment. It is. 
I guess. But I, I, I be seeing people, they be like homeless. They're like 15 and then they'll have the money for abortion. And they be like, oh, well, when I see in a heartbeat, I just changed my mind. You can't even afford to buy noodles. I don't know how you're changing your mind. Sometimes they have resources to help uh, parents. I mean, they can adopt. That's what I'm saying. But like, they be like, oh, I'm going to keep it and raise it. But they sleeping outside. But that's what I'm saying. Sometimes they have resources. They probably get All like homes too. low income housing, yeah. shelters. I don't know. Something. With things sound like slavery. That's what I was saying. That's what I was like. Mm. No, yeah, I think I would, I would think I was just talking fast. I didn't even know I said whippings. I'm handing out whippings. I said whippings, not whippings. When you pronounce the H and the ings, I said ends. Whippings. Whippings. I said whippings. W i p p i n s. It's like your old grandpa would say it. That's not whippings. Not whippings. Whippings sound like whipped cream. <laughs> I haven't been emotional yet, but I know I'm going to cry. Did she say this is her first baby? Because I ain't crying. Oh, yeah, she said yes. Okay, yeah. I never cry, but I'm not, like, emotional like that. How do you feel about, like, when you had a baby and they try to put them on you as soon as they come out and they slime me and ask you? Like, are you okay with that? No, but they yeah. wipe my off. I feel so. like you need to wipe it off. First. Yeah, I don't. Not wipe even it know. off? It's crazy. Because oh, well, you don't know the gender. Just, well, I mean, wipe the baby off. I don't want all that stuff. Oh, well, it's your juice and it's good for you and them. No, it's not. Just not put it's your baby. juice. So I can hold it. No, they wipe the off. Good. resources depending on the state you live in mm-hmm. but we in california so i know we got a lot of great resources Shit. Love, love, point love. me in Gary the direction Lusa. please <laughs> welfare is one um <laughs> baby some of that stuff i mean i guess yeah i guess there's resources available to people who really need it but shit i really need it too you don't worry really no <laughs> yes i do what the hell like y'all think just because people make money we can afford shit no make money shit that stuff is hella expensive. Why I gotta just keep paying full price? Damn, can I get a break one day? Shit. Discount. Man. I'm taking all the free shit at the hospital this time. That, yeah. This pregnancy vlogs, yeah, this shit finna be real. I'm taking, I'm getting them for everything they got. When I go to my uh, lactation appointment, I'm finna load up on that information. They said the hospital will be high though, like 20000 even with insurance. No, it depends on what insurance you have because mine wasn't. But I pay a high uh, monthly payment, but my delivery is free. So, but like, mm-hmm. what are they going to pay for overnight stays? If you give birth to the baby and you leave and you just like, I'm not paying it. Like, what are they going to do? Um, man, you sign paperwork before you go in there. Let me just have a baby in the waiting room. You, they, I'm not signing. They nothing. sign you in, so they got your information. They'll just bill it to you. Exactly. Or go to collections. So like, if you don't pay the bill, you got to go to jail. No. Baby, it's called bad credit, and you're oh, not going to yeah. be able to access a lot of things in life. You need good credit, and you mm-hmm. need to start working on that immediately. Immediately. So I need to get, like, well, I mean, I have, like... I mean, you can probably wait till you in college to get, like, a, some type of credit card, but yes, the credit yeah, is exactly. free, and credit girl, them hospital bills, they don't give a damn. I didn't do shit, mm-hmm. too. What the fuck was that? But they take your ID, everything. I cry like I was in jail with no bond, dog. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> In New York, it's illegal to have What is S2S? Swear to... You get shelter, food stamps, WIC, and Medicaid for free. That's what's up. So, like, even if, you, if you're if you homeless in New York, just get pregnant. Well, it's it's, it's, in New York, it's that's illegal the way out. to have a kid and be homeless. You get shelter, food stamps, <laughs> WIC, and medical for free. Shit. Let me go ahead and you turn know, you homeless in. in New York, just go ahead and get pregnant. Now you got a house. What kind of house in? What state? What uh, area? I'm sure it's very good. Wow. <laughs> I cried with oh, commercials. Oh, What's these stand? What does all that stand for? Uh, and oh, don't that be PJ? We in our thirties. You need to stop with the abbreviations. How old is oh, PJ? Okay, trying to with the like, New Orleans. This that's song? what I'm like. New Orleans. I don't know. Like, what is that? Me Shit, I'm tired of this generation and they damn abbreviations. Bri, you're a part of this generation still. What you looking for, Queen? My clip. Oh. Someone too high. Basically, the whole state. Can I get a luxury apartment? No, <laughs> even though they're not gonna give you that. Just <laughs> you have a city view. <laughs> Bitch, shit. You won't have mice knocking on your door. I'm already know that's what they provided. <laughs> <laughs> Let me in, bitch. We roommates. No, the mice would be crazy. 
Yes, this one girl lived on the 13th floor and it was mice crawling all in her wall and one crawled up her toilet. On the 13th floor, like, ew. Every time I go to New York, I'm going to look in the toilet before I sit on it and get up real fast. That's so that I'm going to jump up and bite. <laughs> Nibble on your booty cheek. <laughs> I'm back to the hospital insane. and now I have rabies. That's insane. You got to deal with mice and roaches, rats defending on the neighborhood. That's what No, I'm I can't saying. do roaches. They said they rats, but you got to think about it. I can do a rat because I'm just kind of like pets. If but I can't already do no homeless in New York, that means they already dealing with rats and roaches and stuff. But now you're dealing with rats and roaches in a home. At least you ain't got to be cold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shit, we got all cuddle together and watch me a cold. I don't know what you Name yeah. the roaches and the rats like Cinderella. Oh, skin to skin. Skin to skin. Yeah, T P J break take Oh, skin to skin. Okay, okay, okay. You gotta stay fresh or get left behind. I need to go back up on the comments. What I don't know what you gotta deal with. Oh, the S2S to S to S to S to rats depending on the neighborhood, unfortunately, but it's not like that everywhere. You gotta stay fresh or get left behind. Well, I'm about to get some rest and just wanted to congratulate you, Panna. Love y'all. Cynthia, that first time that's a kick in your butt, huh? <laughs> I'm happy for her. Her first baby, you know, I remember my first one. Bitch, your first one is still. It wasn't that long ago. Come on now. You know, I'm a mother of two now. I don't play. Like, I've been she doing don't this. Play. She pisses me off. I've been doing Daily. this shit, y'all. Yes. For real. People don't understand what it's like having two. I, and I will never. I don't know. Bitch, I don't understand. I ain't mm-hmm. even at it. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, but I can't do rats. Me neither, baby. Uh uh-uh. uh. I'm not a big fan of the mice and the rats. Other the rodents. Can't do that. My biggest fear the animals on the top three animals I'm scared of raccoon first. <laughs> oh my god. Why did she say it like that? Raccoon. <laughs> because, like, my, I told y'all about like my neighbors. He like this old um white guy. They bought the house. They've been living there for like 50 years and they house all dirty. They got raccoons under the house. And I didn't know we've been living there since 2020. One night I come home like after the second month of being there. Raccoon in front of my house. Raccoon. Nibbling <laughs> on an empty Chick-fil-A box. Was I was yours? shocked. I don't know whose it was. And my brother's <laughs> friends were spending the night. I think it was one of theirs. And then we pull up and my mom put, cut, cut the high beams on the driveway. Raccoon standing in between my neighbor friend and mine. Staring. Why is she saying raccoon like that? The family insane. jumps on the roof and walks. Mm, jumps on the roof of your car? No, uh uh-uh. uh. They be on, a, on my neighbor's roof. But one time I did see raccoon footprints on my dad's roof when he ain't drove his car like three months. That was enough for me. I never knew I was scared of raccoons until I moved there because anywhere I've lived never had a raccoon problem. She said, when I got home, a raccoon. <laughs> it makes me like scared. And the worst experience I ever had, and no, I had two. So my parents gave me a car. No, I can't drive at all by myself because I don't know how. No, I don't have a permit. Um, my parents gave me an Ultima. It's two o'clock in the afternoon. Like it's sunny outside. I'm washing my Ultima, you know, getting all in the grill. A spider jumps out. I'm not really scared of spiders, but I jump because it scared me. I'm like, ah, I keep washing it. I look in the corner of my eye, raccoon on the underside of the fence, bundled up like he's watching a movie, just staring at me. <laughs> I dropped the water hose. I ran in the house. My dad was in the bathroom, boo boo, and I promise you that water ran until he came outside in the next 30 minutes. I didn't cut it off. I didn't do none of that. And then the next time, I was like, oh, Georgie, um, something, something, something. Long story short, I was hanging out in my brother's room. We sleeping head to feet like cousins. He likes to sleep with his blinds all the way open. I open my eyes. It's six in the morning, and his room is right by the fence. The raccoon is staring in the room at me. No. I just sat in my room and was like shaking. I, that, room, that raccoon wants you. No. It's multiple. I don't know if it's the mom and the daddy or the two. You said, you, you said you was looking for a prom date. <laughs> raccoon is available. <laughs> that nigga got his eye on you. Staring at me in my fucking eyes through the uh, window it's is scary. crazy. Fuck. And then what kills it, they don't be scared. I'm like, George, did you go like this? <laughs> No, it was just looking at me with those weird eyes. Little boozy eyes look like a raccoon to me. Now that I've stared at a raccoon eye to eye long enough, I know, like, the sunken in eyes just look like a raccoon. Um, I will not get out the car. My brother threw a bottle at it, and it still was sitting there. We have no raccoons. So that's why raccoons animal number one. Animal number two. Somebody, I like Animal Planet. You gotta scare them before they scare you. <laughs> no, they don't. Some don't be scared. The mice in New York think they regular people. They walk amongst you and want some of your food right in front of you. No, you're not getting. <laughs> Can I get some of that pizza? No. Yes, yeah, so I don't like raccoons, then rats, then possums, 
Then, um, yeah, that's it. So you don't like nothing along the lines of that family? I don't First like of all, that. if you see a raccoon during the day, don't they got rabies or something? Because no, they they're nocturnal. They sick. Yeah. But they, got, he, they, they got, got something. The, their house is like, it's not elevated. My house got two stairs and front stairs do too, but it's not elevated. It has like There's holes. There's do too? The raccoon's home? Oh, no. Yeah, they <laughs> live there. The neighbors don't care. They got burrows under their house. He was like sitting under the house, but like... In on the, the dark, side of the uh, yeah. in the dark just and oh my god, just talking about it make my body tremble. Like, <laughs> oh, I hate raccoons, rats. Um, it was a point in time, my granny neighborhood it, down in the ghetto. Okay, look, there was never no rats in her house. Um, they was under it though. Uh, <laughs> my god, brother, his grandma lived down the street. He came down the street. He came in our house. Him and his little cousin had to be like six. He like my granny got rats. And they was uh -huh. fighting in the cabinets. That's why kids get on my damn nerves. Like, fighting in the cabinets is crazy. <laughs> my mama said, oh, baby, don't tell nobody that no more. <laughs> he was so excited. Him and his cousin came over. My granny got rats. My granny. They want us to come over and look at them and all that. No, thank you. <laughs> um, and then, because we have, like, a house got tore down next to his grandma's house. And then we have a field across the street. You know, field mice. And, and it's right by the barn. Too, too many mice. Long story short. And then possums. My granny got attacked by a possum. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's why I'm scared of possums. Uh, she was in San Rafael at work and she came home and like was having my dad check out her ankle and all this. She had little scratches. She didn't what? have no rabies. Her and she worked for um clients. Well she she don't work for them no more. But her and her coworkers, they was outside trying to take out garbage or something and a possum was scratching my granny ankle and chasing her and her coworkers. <laughs> what? My poor granny. I thought she had rabies. I thought it was over. You know, humans can't come back from rabies. <laughs> They really can't though. Really? Them shits, yeah, them shits just take you out. Wait, does rabies turn you into like a zombie or something? What they do? Are you fucking dumb? <laughs> no. Don't you like get like? Bitch, you don't start eating people. No. no, that's a zombie. Are you eat your skin? No, your mouth no. just get foamy like a dog, and it be nasty. Are you dumb? <laughs> I, don't you know. Know. I always thought rabies made you go like crazy. Ain't wasn't it like that in cabin fever or something? Bitch, <laughs> like they had rabies. I don't know, but I thought rabies, I always thought rabies, like, when they attack you, you get aggressive, and you start attacking other people. Oh, and you like them. an animal. Bitch, you get sick and die. You get no, out. haven't y'all heard that? Because when, when a dog gets oh, rabies, uh, they get aggressive. Hey, 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 hold this up. Ray, who is you talking to? Don't talk to him, Mookie. Well, Ray, Sanai, and PJ, stop talking oh, to her. You gotta get him, too, because he was smart, <laughs> Lonnie's desperate for a man, y'all. She's doing whatever it takes. Ray has four uh, boys. I don't care what she got. She's trying to have a fifth, and that's not hers. Ray, did I tell you I was pregnant, girl? What I missed, yes. But no, Ray, that does not happen. No, when, I'm telling you, when a dog gets rabies, they get aggressive. They attack other dogs. Dogs, not Cujo. humans. She got that from Cujo, the movie, where the dog attacked the people with his foam and mouth because he got rabies. So oh, that's where I got that from? Yes. Mm. <laughs> you just think Cujo, you just probably don't remember. Mm -mm. That movie was crazy. He was trying his uh, his phone mouth was his mouth phone was all on the car window. It was all sloppy. I love you too. They right can't now. give us no shot or nothing. I don't know. I think the shot is gonna put you down, <clears throat> like for good. Uh, you just gotta. I think you guys gotta catch it early. I love you too, Ray. I was just kidding. So how do I know if the raccoons by my house have rabies? They, they, they got it. You don't know. They I don't, got it. I don't know if they're signs. If they rabbit. And I, my mom called Peta two times or whatever the people did not Peta animal control pet not, Peta. pest control. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, what the and they never did nothing about it. So I told my dad he went to poison the raccoons. That never happened either. Wait, what? Yes, I wanted them dead in my backyard. You told so him to poison them or he did poison them? I told him to, but he ain't, he ain't been on the job. Not him. No, I should not feel unsafe in my own home. They That's go. animal cruelty. Kimaya, they have families. What if you kill them all? Oh my gosh. The daddy and them gonna die too. They all go feast together. Do you ever think in your head that's how he feels about you? Um, and they want to take you out? This is civilization. They need to go to the bushes. No. Wait, 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 listen. They're a part of this earth too, and they deserve love. Look, I don't mind any other animal, but rats and raccoons, they don't deserve no love from me. I'm they sorry. Do. Wait, do you think raccoons know that they think they about named, Stuart Little? They actually raccoons? Like you think they Yeah, know like names? do rats know their name rats or spider know they a spider? No, no. they just be existing. <laughs> they just buy oh, them. We're trying to she at home. But we know that we humans. That's yeah, crazy. We do. They might call us something else then in their own language. And you we don't know don't? that we're bad. They yeah. communicate somehow. Them lions don't be roaring for nothing. They don't do sign language. <laughs> oh, wow. Wait. Imani, I like that shit high key. They Maybe. mouth will be foaming. Not, mm. I don't yeah, play about toxic you. love. They love is one sided. It's only Imani. Or I, 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 I like Imani. I like that shit. Ugh. 
I you like it when I do a PJ? I'm fighting for you, baby. No, bitch. Toxic. I love it. You need to stay away from my man. Get off my man. Who's your man? PJ. No, it's not. Like, your no. man is Andre. Don't nobody want you two kids, flappy puss. You use that <laughs> now. Drake wants you. That's it. Yeah, my man still want me, y'all. <laughs> and you know he really your man if he's still trying to like you know get with you and be all blended you when you ain't shower for three days. Goodness. Baby, what? I didn't shower. Well, like I'm just saying, like for example, if you didn't shower. D- Drake loves her dirty drawers. Okay. Y'all, I'll be waking up in the morning. I'm like, you're hella beautiful. I'm morning like, breath yes. and all. That's your man. Yes. No, Brie, tell him what you really do. You say, you be like, Ugh, move. Yeah, move. <laughs> oh my God. The, like two days ago, because like every morning in the morning he kisses me goodbye, and like I do be getting an attitude when he don't kiss me goodbye because it's like why would you just leave and not kiss me goodbye? Yeah. It's like he does it every morning because he mm-hmm. leaves at five a.m. So he does it every morning. So when he doesn't do it, it's like, what the fuck? But the other morning. He was like, kiss me goodbye, and he was like, can I touch your titty? And that shit pissed me off so uh, bad, because uh, I'm like, first of all, it's 5 in the morning. Like, I like for him to kiss me and then get on. Like, don't yeah. kiss me all the time, so I'm not really trying to fully wake up. I just want to, like, you know that wake yeah, up where you kiss and go back to yeah. yeah, he's like, about, I just want to touch your titty. Huh? I'm like, just touch it, right? Then he digging all under the covers. You oh, don't need to no, get under the covers. Yeah, just uh-uh. the same titty that you didn't touch for 40 years. Like, 40 I don't need you doing all of that. And he like, damn man, I just wanted to touch a titty. Like, go to work. You say he could touch it. He just start trying to go. I said he could touch it over the covers. You don't gotta dig all in the covers. Fuck up my warm spot. Like it's just. (laughs) Oh my god. He's like, you should be glad I still hella love you. Look at me. Why wouldn't you? Who wouldn't? That's what you gotta tell him. No, he just hella loves me. I love him too, but like, just no. Not, I love him too. Maybe he's like more affectionate. I, do. I love him after 7 a.m. I don't love nobody <laughs> before 7 a.m. I don't. I don't. I don't. That's crazy. I don't. This I don't. ain't Texas. I'm gonna wake up and be Beyonce. You keep waking me up two hours before my time. Beyonce yeah. said she woke up like that regardless what time she woke up. Mm. You Damn, can't really just chew me up. <laughs> you definitely chew Let that man touch that. Now he said you mean. Next row finna be big as a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get her out of here. <laughs> gotta get her out of here. That's so funny. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Amani's overhanded cute. Mm-hmm. I remember I was watching Marriage Boot Camp and this lady was complaining about how her husband likes to tongue kiss when I wake up in the morning and when we And that just like made my stomach hurt. Because why? No, that's you making way a too disease. Far. That's nasty. <laughs> that's one way too far. Making a disease is crazy. Some people don't have bad morning breath though. I do. I know, but still, like, yo, I was like, mine be bad. Uh, it should be hot as fuck. <laughs> really? And then, like, when you can smell it with your mouth closed, that just, like, that irritates Ugh. me. That irritates me. But that's, like, if I sleep with my mouth open. I don't sleep with my mouth open. You do? When I'm hecka tired, I do. Mm-hmm. Even the kid dad does like that. He literally does that all day. No, for real. It's like, oh, my God. When Dre started just staring, I'd go upstairs because I already know what that means. I ain't doing that right now. <laughs> just staring. Just uh, staring is crazy. Yes. It would be like a creepy stare just see, you know, that stare. I can't do nothing with Dre. <laughs> if I be like, like, if I like go sit on him and cuddle, he'd be like, ooh, no. See, no. Uh-huh. No. <laughs> no, because I ain't trying to take it there. And he'd be like, don't start nothing. You can't finish. Uh, let oh, me get, my let God. Let me go ahead and get up. <laughs> I guess I can't. <laughs> Y'all, I'd be so lazy. Look how this how I got in this predicament. Shit. I was doing your big one. Man. I was. <clears throat> My big one. Yeah. They, should, they say that we like country Beyonce. It's actually not bad, but like it doesn't it. give like hella country to me. So like, I think I like it. And I know? feel like social media is going to play it out. That's what's going to make me kind of not be a fan of it. But I do like it right now. Yeah, I, I like it. Listen, it's, but I, I feel snippets. like I like it, but like I wouldn't put it on a playlist. Mm-mm. But if it comes on, like it's not a bad song. Yeah, I wouldn't turn it. Yeah. I still trying to make a new one. Did y'all like the new Cardi B? Uh, oh yes. They said did y'all see her video? The video. I part seen of the video. She was, who she? They said she was talking about JT. 
Oh, I don't know. She looked really good in it, though. I didn't listen she to the did. The outfit was nice. I seen a clip of the video. I like the silver outfit. The mm -hmm. one where she was kind of doing, like, the... Uh, she was almost doing, like, a drag-type look in the beginning. Mm -hmm. It was cute on her, but, like, I really like that silver look. They said she was uh, pay paying homage to, like, I think, Missy Elliott, Lil' Kim. They, mm -hmm. She, like, uh, redid their outfits. Okay. That's what's up. I like the song, though. Mm -hmm. Some people were saying it didn't eat, but I follow a lot of, like... I follow a lot of... Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, and Lotto haters. So, like, I be seeing a mixture of, like, yeah, I follow all different opinions. Things. Yeah. Yeah. They say when a pregnant woman braids your hair, it will make your hair grow right, Jody. And I'm just braiding hella good now. Like, I feel like this pregnancy has really made well, me a better braider. I'm bald-headed. I need my hair to grow. You're not bald-headed. Well, we about to grow your hair back out. I'm short-headed. Yeah. I'm short-headed. It's crazy. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out how. But I'm not mad at country Beyonce. Do y'all feel bad for Kay Michelle? What? What, what happened? happened? I guess like she had tried to like throw a shot at Beyonce or whatever because you no. know she did, she did country before, and you know everybody's talking about her uh, Beyonce being number one on the country charts first black woman. Your Kay Michelle, she's Beyonce. Let's start there. You were on Love and Hip Hop. I was telling my my first client this morning that like I feel like Beyonce is at the point in her career like no matter what genre she goes into, she it's going to be at the top. Yeah, yeah Beyonce's going to do she wants. She's just I feel like number one, she's just that good, but also her 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 fans are just locked in, like you know. Yeah, yeah. she did all her work in the two thousands. Now she retired. Mm hmm. The last real album that I liked, like by Beyonce, was Lemonade. Like, and that wasn't even real singing. Like, Beyonce ain't did real singing, I feel like, in a long time. I like Lemonade. But I like, you know, Lemonade. I like some of the Renaissance album, too. Renaissance, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really care for a I'm lot like of that. A um, I did like some of the songs, but mm -hmm. it's not an album I would throw on. I'm not even gonna lie. But I think it was great for like a show purpose, mm -hmm. but no. I, when it comes to like R and B singers like a Beyonce, I'm looking. I like more of her ballads. So like a Dangerously in Love, One yeah, Plus One. I like that type of vibe. Yeah. So for me, Renaissance, all that click clacking is just too much noise for me. It's too much noise for me. And I also like a SZA type vibe. Like I kind of like vibey oh, R and B. Like um, you don't necessarily got to be singing hella good, but just like you know her the beats, flow. yes, and the flow, her voice, mm -hmm. the melody, and all that. Yeah, SZA's so voice is just like the best thing. Yeah. But Sexy Red is starting to get on my nerves a little bit. That's one artist I can say. I'm not a fan. She got a new song out? No, I just started, like, I feel, I'm ghetto, you know, I'm around ghetto people, but there's a such thing as too ghetto, and some of the stuff she be doing is just annoying now. I feel she like she kind of dying down a little bit. Yeah, like she's not going to be in the spotlight for that. Well, now. after the baby. She's yeah. not like a Nicki or a Cardi or a Mulatto nah. or a Megan that can stay hot. She's going to fall off the wagon like a little punk. I feel like that about uh, Glorilla. Really? No, I like that. Yeah, Glow. You don't oh, like yes. that? That shit is bumping. That's on my playlist. The first time I seen it was LeBron singing it, like, in the mirror. <laughs> the yeah, Glow. <laughs> she actually ate with that. Can you pass me yeah, a Pacific cool. I thought she fell off, but I ain't gonna lie. That, that, that song is that. nice. Yeah. yeah. I haven't Did you hear? Mm -mm. I like it. She's spitting. Yeah, because she ain't put nothing out in a while, so I was like, damn, Glow fell off. Yeah. She, um, and then, you I know, that's been saying, out for a couple weeks. They were saying Sexy Red kind of likes to curt, you know, flow. Oh my god, Sexy Red cannot rap, though. And she's talking about the same stuff. I love Big Sexy. I was about to say, Amani's was the one who told me about her album, but I turned it on. I don't like it. it I don't know, like, it's just her aura. And I'm not one of those, like, you know, people, oh, she's too ghetto. No, it's a way to be ghetto. And it's a way to be trifling and grimy. Every time they post leading cases of STDs, they always put her picture next to it. And that, you know, I don't know why. <laughs> But that may speak what? volumes. That's super sick. Not for real. Y'all, um, okay. That's sick as fuck. Me still saying you whipping is crazy. It I takes, feel like it's been hella long. It's it's only been four weeks. What happened? It takes six weeks. She slept on toilet tissue in the club bathroom. Ooh. Well, thank you. <laughs> you know, Amani falls all the time. I Got a blast! We I never gonna let that, uh, let that down. I went to the club on the first y'all and slipped and sprained my knee. On the first of the year? On the first of February. Oh, I was about to say. So it takes six weeks. So I think in about three weeks I'll be fully cool. Yeah, Glow is eating on that song. 
I love me some sexy red, really. Yeah, she makes she just make her songs are just hella catchy. That's it. But I gotta be like in the mood to hear that. It ain't like an everyday thing. But if I'm like trying to be turned and like get my mood up, I'll be like, yeah, let me turn on some. I gotta sexy. tell y'all about um David. Oh God, yeah, David. David? Mm -hmm. Who was David? So the one that I told you guys I was not physically attracted to. Oh, the one, but she was just talking to him. So I'm gonna read this. And then ever since then at school, he hasn't been speaking to me. Mind you, I ain't never speak first. He's been chasing me since elementary. You know what it is. I'm, I'm her. Um, so, February 20th, he says, you going to prom with anyone? And if not, you trying to go with me? I said, oh, I wish you would have been asked. My brother, my date. You can't tell him now? <laughs> I said, not going to lie. I wouldn't feel right uninviting my little brother after he's already been invited and his best friend going to be there because his best friend dates my friend. Mm -hmm. He said, all right, whatever, it's good. I said, you're not mad at me, right? He said, it is what it is. I had my whole outfit to match you too. It was good, though. I'm trying to figure out why you bought a suit to match my dress color if you haven't even asked me yet. If you're buying... You showed him your dress already? Yeah. Well, no, but I told him my color. If you're buying royal blue, buy royal blue because you want to buy royal blue. Otherwise, if you're going to buy royal blue for me, why don't you ask him to be your date first? Is that not, like, stupid? Yeah. And I feel like he was trying to make me feel bad for that. You're not going to make me feel bad. You didn't ask me. And my brother's going to look like a good accessory because this is my prom at the end of the day, not his. He's going to be a great accessory to me. You're not. <laughs> What's your brother look like? It's your little brother? Yeah. Oh, okay. He, um, she he dark. Like he, uh, let me find a post on my mama's social media. You don't feel weird going with your brother, though? Because what you going to do when the slow dance come on? Oh, we don't do slow dances. Last prom, it was all ghetto hoochie pop. What? Y'all yeah. don't got a slow dance no more? Mm -mm. Then what's the point in having a date? It's like, does my brother like not have photos? I didn't do nothing with my date, my senior prom, because he was my friend. So it's just like, mm -mm. really? Well, I only take ugly pictures of him because he's my brother, but that's my brother. No, he's cool. He likes the girl. Mm, he's cool. Okay, yeah, that's a better picture. I don't know why he's smelling like that. That's when we went to the Lakers game. Mm. That's my dad. My dad think he looks better than my brother and tries to be in competition with him. My brother looks way better. Um, what you saying? Your daddy ugly? Right. My dad's not ugly, but you know, he's in this midlife crisis thing. Oh, yeah, you copying my swag. I look better than you. And he like still talks like he's in the 2000s. <laughs> and that's what kills me. I'm weird. Like that, so. My daddy hella fine. Your yeah, dad is yeah. very cute. Ugh, I'm he is really cute. Yeah, that is cute. I can't say too much because we don't lie, but Imani no. <laughs> uh -uh. no. All my friends be like, I want your daddy. That's oh, hella nasty. That's cute. Not I'm just much. saying, if Kelly and him decide to go his way, no, I'll it be wouldn't, his, if you go be ready, it wouldn't be I'll be his first body. It would. That's crazy. <laughs> Don't tell your mama that because that's how awkward like me praying, praying on her man. You praying on her man the whole time. Like, it's crazy. I'm not even praying on him now. It's just like if he end up single and I'm single, it's just like, let's fucking do it. Yikes. <laughs> what if Amani was my stepmom? That would be kind of sick, actually. <laughs> Bitch, that would be your last day at the job. <laughs> Is it not his first body, LOL? <laughs> you can't fire your stepmom, Brie. Come on, y'all. Hmm? Talk about that would be your last day at the job. You can't fire your stepmom. I feel like if my if my parents split up and my dad got a new girl, I'll be hella rude to her. Like, you would. Uh, you have that. <laughs> and your parents been together too long. Mm -hmm. They're not going nowhere. But if they, you know, just but at the same time, they're not going nowhere. They've been together for like almost forty years. Four years. Four years. Four is good. Yes. Forty. Thank forty. You. Kanesha. Kanesha. That's cool. I could imagine being with somebody Kenyasha. for forty years. I, I say it. Hmm? I could imagine being with somebody for four years. I salute people who can do it though, but like. I would like, I'm, I think it's ADHD. I'm like, I need something new. <laughs> Instantly. Because like, oh, like girls say, oh, I'll just switch my wig. I'll just, this. no, I need a new person. I'm new really, eyes, new body. New eyes, new body is crazy. Now, I might grow out of it. Let's hope. Otherwise, you ain't fuck me. Yeah, fuck me. Now call a body. <laughs> That's what it's giving. Mm -hmm. I got a new body, so I need some new. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. I can't wait to do my weight loss journey. What? After I have my kid. You really gonna lose weight? Yes, I'm gonna go stupid. I can't wait. So what's the first thing you gonna do? <sighs> Not if she really pregnant. <laughs> yes, y'all. Why don't ever people believe me when I say something? Because you'll be playing too much, Bri. <laughs> I ain't played in a long time. Like yeah. I've been serious since I've had Kai. Uh, I'm not no joking ass bitch. Just no, you your shit, bitch. You was joking on uh on Halloween two years in a row, huh? 
<laughs> yeah. Yo, when am I gonna do this shit for Halloween? Because I'm it's, pregnant. You're again. gonna be. Like, wait, you're not gonna. Wait, you're not. Oh, you might pregnant. not be though. You'll I be just want to be. The baby yeah, I'll be. I'll be postpartum. I just want it to be something regular, but it's like I can't do that. You need a costume with two kids, the Bernstein Bears, <laughs> <laughs> you, Dre, and the kids. <laughs> That's a good idea. That's if I could slap the back of your neck with baby powder, I would. That's the first thing that came to mind. The first thing. Two kids. <laughs> two round, big ass parents. <laughs> Why she do you like this? Oh my god! Damn it! Can you pass me the, the comb? Let me see the comb. I got new combs, y'all, because bitches been stealing my combs. Or I could have been an Adam's family. That's why my parts are good, because these new combs are sharp. You're gonna have two kids. Sharp in a bit. Look at that. Where you get these from? You nice and them? sharp. Yeah, but I ordered them. Yeah, but I ordered them. <laughs> they hella sturdy. Feel these combs versus the other ones. Don't they feel like just new combs? The late grow combs. Don't read my brand, Hope. Mm. These, these combs sharp. They feel sharp when you scalp? No. Mm. Mm. She ain't going <laughs> deep enough. <laughs> they feel light. I mean, sharp. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Real sharp. Real I'm telling you, I couldn't be like how you just did that. Like, if I was in an actual instance, right? Like, incident like that, and somebody asked me something, and somebody whispers, like, say yes, or, like, it hits me or something, like, I'm just gonna start laughing. I don't think I can actually, like, what? Keep my head the type. You know how people be doing the loyalty <laughs> test when they call you? Keep my head. Wasn't I with you yesterday? I know. Girl, no, I was in my bed. <laughs> She be, she be like, when? Keep my head. Oh. Wasn't I with you at the store? Bree, I said no. <laughs> like, quit asking. Like, Keep my head. Weren't we at the store? And, I, and we seen the pickles? Girl, if, I was at home. Like, if we don't FaceTime, no. I might be like, oh, uh, yeah. But it'll be kind of delayed. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to say call me. Y'all ever did the like loyalty test and call people just to see if they're lucky? Y'all want to do, do that? Y'all want to do it right now and see if we each got to call uh, we each gotta call one person yeah. and see if they'll do it for us? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Who you going to call, Bri, your dad? I'm going to call. <laughs> no, my dad, call your no, my dad be like, I'm not a liar. Let me call. <laughs> let me call my dad. Okay, no. Let me do it like this. Is. We each got to do it with one of our parents. Okay. 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 Give me your phone, Imani. What's I gotta give you my phone for? Cause I'm on my phone. I gotta call the person from your phone. Oh, we'll call my dad. Cause my mom will be like, please stop talking to me. Call your daddy. Call my dad. No, bitch. You want his number? <laughs> not not call your daddy. Okay, y'all want me to call my daddy or my mama? Your dad. Yeah, he's just yeah, so no, funny. Cause he ain't finna lie. Okay, After you get you all the baby yeah. days. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh shit. Who was you FaceTiming? Oh, Jenna. I hung up real quick, though. Mm. Hold on, let me text him and say, this is Bree answer. Because he'd probably be screaming. Hold on. And don't text my daddy again. <laughs> when you after you go, I'm like, hey. <laughs> Excuse hey, me, uh, who is this? It ain't Bree this time. Your secret admirer, sweetie. Jean, I go here. It's Mario. Who you on the phone with? <laughs> don't tell him. Imani almost got the digits. I see you, sis. Period. See, I had two kids and one girl. Me and partner said we were done. Got pregnant. And boom, it's What, you got predictive text on or something? Oh, yeah, I like that. No, I don't like that. Okay, don't touch my shit. Just text and keep it pushing. I'm touching you, y'all. No. You got 257 unread messages. You need to get out my business. Okay, I'm finna call. I'm nervous. Okay, okay. I'm gonna tell him I'm with Dre and see if he'll laugh at me. I already know he not, because he a Christian. <laughs> you know? I just know my daddy. Brie, now she got the digits in there. Hello? Hey, daddy, it's Brie. Oh, you on a different line? Yeah, I'm with uh, Dre right now, but my phone was dead. Bree, Bree's here. Bree, don't call me Let me call you right back. No, 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 it's not nothing important. Oh, nothing important? No, okay. no I'm, with, um, I'm with Dre right now, though. Wasn't I at your house oh. yesterday? Again? Didn't I come over your house yesterday? Was it yesterday the funeral? After the funeral? Didn't I stay there for a couple hours before I came home? Yeah, we were at the funeral yesterday. Yeah, she was. No, she just asked me a question. Oh, uh, did she come? Did she stop by after the funeral? Wasn't I there for like three, four hours after the funeral? Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on a second, baby. I was, I was doing something on my phone. Give me a second. Okay, go ahead now. I said after the funeral, wasn't I there for about three, four hours before I came home? Because I said I was tired and I had to take a nap. No, you wasn't. <laughs> Dad, wasn't I there yesterday for like three or four hours? You don't no, remember. You wasn't. Dad, no, you wasn't. Dad. 
at your mother. Like, I was there and I took a nap. <laughs> Remember? Are you, are you? Did you dream it? <laughs> no, I lived it. Okay, well, I don't know why you want me to lie. <laughs> See, Dad, you failed. This was a loyalty test to see if you would have my back. And once again, you don't ever have my back. No, it's not a loyalty test. You're asking me to lie. <laughs> yes, yes, that's exactly what I'm asking. You're supposed to have my back. I'm your daughter, your only daughter. Yeah, but you're asking me to lie in front of your husband. And why would you want to do that? Dad, my husband's not here. I'm doing a loyalty test. Oh, your husband ain't there. Why, why are you lying to me, Dad? It's called a test. It's called a prank. It's called a loyalty test. Well, I wouldn't do it. <laughs> I would never call you. If I'm ever in if I'm ever in trouble and I need somebody to cover for me, I just want to let you know. I'm not calling you. Okay. okay. Call your mother then. I don't know. She's right here. I don't see her doing the same thing. Give her the phone. Let me talk to her. Did she hear me? Yeah, she heard you. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, wasn't that wasn't I there taking a nap? Well, you were snoring. <laughs> See, that's who I should have called. Thank you, Mom. I couldn't even. I couldn't even wake you up. Oh, thank you. Okay. I thank knew. You wasn't I knew you were my favorite. Did that hurt you? Did that hurt your feelings, Dad? Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, bye. So what's up? Nothing. You made me lose the challenge. That's what's up. Okay. Why you ask me? <laughs> Dad, you were nominated. Okay. No shit? Yeah, no shit. I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. 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 I'm so dead, dead. Dead. but your mama had you, though. <laughs> I knew he was not going to lie. He said, you no. want me to lie to your husband? To your husband? <laughs> yes. Like, what the fuck? It's your turn. Oh, it's my turn. It can't be Monty's turn. Should I call my dad or my granny? Because I still live with my parents. So, like, I mean, I call my dad because he be working night shifts. But, but like, I need to be I'm like, so, I'm going to argue on with my little friend right now. He thinks I was out somewhere cheating on him. Was I not with you last night? Okay, yes. But my dad know I was at home. Well, see if he got your back. See if he got your back. Let's Just say, okay, yeah. I'm going to hold on. Let me put you on. No, I'm not going to put him on, quote, unquote, third way. Just. I could be the dude. I could be the dude's worst. I don't think you can. You're lying. <laughs> Dad, what are you doing? You know, I know it's rare I ever call you about problems like this, but long story short, I'm having a problem with my little friend. I don't remember what I was doing last night. He's trying to say that I was out cheating on him because my Snapchat location said something different. I swear to God. But was I not with you last night? Yeah. I mean, I don't care what they think anyway, but yeah, I mean, it's a fucking thing. Okay, but I don't want him to stop talking to me. Uh, I don't know what to tell you. If somebody really interested in you, they'd be really more toward trying to believe you and not believe you. So, we don't chase nobody around here. Okay, I love you. I love you, too. Bye. Like, why are you so serious? He's hella serious. He <laughs> cares what they think. Yeah. Somebody really love you. I'm weak. Imani. Imani, who you gonna call her? Mom. You gonna call her? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so y'all, if y'all hear me call her Gail, that's her middle name. I call my mom by her middle name. Okay. Not her dad is a writer. I need that. I just asked him. I said if I brought a different man all in the same year to Thanksgiving, a different one to Christmas, a different one to Christmas Eve, and a different one to New Year's, you ain't gonna say nothing. He said I'll pull you to the side, but I ain't saying nothing. I said yeah, you nasty. <laughs> <laughs> Not I'll pull you to the side. That's a real one though. Okay, okay. Here we go. Here we go. I'm a loser. Yeah, you are. 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 Yeah, Gail. Yeah. Wasn't I with you last night? What? <laughs> Wasn't I with you at the house last night? Yeah. So what do we? What? Wasn't I with? Wasn't we at the house together yesterday? Last night. I mean, we weren't together yesterday. At night, but I'm saying we was together last night, like around nine o'clock, right? Yeah. Were y'all together? Were y'all together eating at IHOP? Oh, I have. Mm-hmm. What? Hey, why are you trying to get me to <laughs> oh, be telling stories? Don't be telling me telling stories. Absolutely not. What? <laughs> Mama gave you up. 
Gail. First of all, it was a loyalty test to see if you would have my back. Absolutely not. Then you go and then how you gonna start and say yeah and then you gonna be and say absolutely not. What if my, what if my life was on the line? She heard I have and said no, I don't do that. <laughs> Give me like better signals. You just wanted to say yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's way too late. Yeah. Okay, girl. See, see yeah, you later. Wait a minute, no. uh, I don't did it. What, what are you? I'm at work, girl. <laughs> oh, I need you to send me. Yeah, okay. I had to sponsor well, that. Cause... I need you to send me the login to the listeners. I got to log me out. That's the I have. Absolutely not. No. No, I don't do I have. <laughs> Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Just when you get settled, because it sounds like you're driving and you came off that task. So just call it, just do it when you sit down, okay? Bye. Uh, maybe, um, you know what your mama had? Sorry, to, I had to, about the eye. No, I had to do that up, because you wasn't giving enough detail. Wasn't we together last night? Yeah, we was together. No, no but she talking was about... Were you together she, at I I house. said last night, wasn't we together at 9 o'clock? Well, we was together during the day. Right, that's not what I said, together, mama. We was together yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> No, no, absolutely not. What? Why are you trying to put me in this stud? I'm not. Yeah, nah. <laughs> oh, she's a high class. I don't know I hop at all nine. I hop. I don't even do breakfast foods. <laughs> she got me so <laughs> fucked up. Damn, so Kimaya Daddy, the only one that's arrived there. Actually, get your mom too. You get and your mom too. Oh, my mama gonna lie. That's right. My mom ain't shit. Cause bro. guess what? I'm your daughter first. No, for real. My brother's gonna lie, not Berto, but Mario will. He'll be like, yeah, yeah. Berto's gonna be like, why? I don't wanna lie about anything. <laughs> Hang up, <laughs> click, click. Do, do, do. Uh, uh, fuck off my go. phone. Believe him, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so, Berto, like your dad. Yes. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> well, Kimaya, congratulations. My yeah, daddy's too went. serious, that's why, but he, he kind of grimy because, you know, he used to do stuff like that. So he just think that's okay. <laughs> well, if I got to bring multiple people a week, why shouldn't my children? Dad, have you not heard of STD? Come on now. Gail, so, Gail had you on the surface line. She wasn't going to get in too deep, though. Yeah, IHOP just it was too much for her. She's like, no, we did not go to IHOP last night. At She's like, what's going on? Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> what? Y'all, what if we was uh, what if we was potentially going to jail? Like my that's what I'm saying. What if my life was on the line? She's like, well, <laughs> well, it's crazy. Now I'm in cell block C, getting my booty touched. <laughs> Touch. That's so disrespectful. Mm -mm. That was actually funny. <sighs> well, y'all, y'all know who. It is. I hope y'all doing y'all own personal loyalty test right now. Let us know how it goes. <laughs> Yeah. We need to reevaluate some people in our life. We do. <laughs> At least I know who not to call. Shit. <laughs> Don't call your daddy, but call your mama. I'm not calling my dad. <laughs> I wasn't with you. You said you was at the liquor store about to hit a lick. Like, like God. come on, dad. The cops yeah. right here. <laughs> Weren't you driving the Jeep? <laughs> Damn. What's, What's the... equivalent to not dropping the soap, the soap for women? Oh. Maybe I don't know. I ain't never been incarcerated. Me either. I'm, I'm Me still either. underage. Me either. She I ain't trying to die. I hope that was beneath her. But yeah, I did lose her. I have. I should have said no. Boo. That's because Imani, you wasn't giving enough information. Yeah, yeah. you was like, wasn't I with you last night? Like, that's at the too club, easy. at the IHOP, at church. I said at home. Too. I said, wasn't we together at home around nine o'clock yesterday? She said, Yeah. What? What? No, <laughs> huh? Yeah, like she could hear you. I just need her to be like, yeah, we was. Real cool comment collected. My mom, I'm happy I didn't call her. Name. I had to switch mine up because I really did go to my parents' house at the funeral. That's why I had to add in four hours. I got to see if he really going to ride for me. And no. Like, wait, wait, wait. Hours. At first, he's like, yeah, yeah. She was there. She was there. And so you yeah, said, took a nap for four hours. Took no. a nap. No. 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 Your mom was like, yeah, she was snoring. I couldn't even wake you up. <laughs> a real rider. Period. Y'all see my mama? real rider. Okay, your mom, your mom was a writer too, but at the same time, your okay. mom was a writer, but she only gonna ride so long. <laughs> yeah, Jesus came, she, going for them no, extra for lies. Mm -mm. She, she really did. Throw she gonna ride with you around the corner, but she ain't going to. She ain't driving to LA with you. She really did draw the line at IHOP though. <laughs> She's like, I don't want to be a caught up in your foolishness. Would you think I'm gonna go to jail or something? It was foolish. I hate when my dad does that. 
Why do you call me with these lies? My dad is a cruel joke. It was a prank. He's so serious, bro. My dad do too. That's why I'm happy I didn't tell him it was a prank because he was finna get into a lecture right there. I'm happy he ended it. That's why I just said, I love you, because it would have went on. I love minutes. you, too. Like, I care about you. He said, we don't chase people around here. That's what I like. A true I knew my daddy wasn't going to lie. You should have said my mama. <laughs> I just wanted to get his, not lock his number in. Uh, I heard twerking. Cake, 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 cake. Mm-hmm. Ooh, baby, I like you. I go to school with this dude named Simon. He on a cane. And he's in my grade. I don't he know what? what happened to him. He's on a cane. I don't really care and I don't catch it. I don't know. He be walking slow on the cane. Maybe he did. I don't know. I wonder what happened to Simon. No, last year, junior year, though, he was always riding a scooter and all that. They probably, uh, what's it called? But like a cane? That's not me like me. Like, mom, you're not going to cane. hurt in your armpit, books. Mm-hmm. I know I had to mention she don't remember five minutes ago. Oh, Miss Nessa, you real good. Let me get her number. <laughs> Hell, it's not <laughs> five you in trouble. Good. Hell is hot. Miss Netta Mama, wasn't I with you yesterday? Uh-huh. Eating popcorn? Speaking of Miss Netta, how do y'all feel about Charles Miss Netta? Charles, your lunch is ready. Charles, your Why are they famous? Are they just like social media famous? Yes, because she always making Charles lunch, but you giving Charles T-bone steaks and mashed potatoes for lunch, what he don't eat for dinner? <laughs> That's a dinner meal. She always giving Charles a of big food for lunch. So weak. And then she be trying to run Charles and boss Charles around. First of all, Charles has a whole wife and a child. They need a TV show. Excuse me? Yes, he has a, a wife. She's a she's a white lady. I feel like y'all they all seen her because they be wait. So what? Wait, are they a couple though? I don't know. They posted a video of Miss Netta saying happy birthday to Charles in 2022 with his family. But the whole family was singing happy birthday in slow motion. And I knew Charles, all his crews went tight up there. <laughs> and the rest of the family was like that too. It was like, Wait, so are they famous on TikTok or Instagram? Both. Mm-hmm. What's that video I found where they was exposing Miss Netta for being a narcissist? What the fuck? <laughs> and they said she looked like Shannon Sharp. She do look like <laughs> Shannon Sharp. <laughs> <laughs> that's so evil for Shannon you don't deserve that wait but Miss Net- Miss Netta was born a man right yes. yeah what, what the hell are you serious what I don't really know him like that baby have you seen the face <laughs> <laughs> that is a man did you see a wedding hold on okay you guys stop calling me Netta you know it's Net. did I say Miss Netta yes you always call her uh, Miss Netta <laughs> sorry like for lunch Got some garlic bread. Are y'all ready? You got a twist to it today. Let's go. Ready. Charles. Uh, yeah. Ready. She be watching what him. What the hell is she wearing? Her Valentine's Day. Look like what? Mm-mm. You really thought that was a woman? He's scary. <laughs> Come on, Bree. Okay, Charles taking too long. Let me see you there. That's really her man? Yes, but Charles is special. I think she's Charles' caretaker. That's hella food. For lunch, it's crazy. Like, I don't eat. Today. Baby, stop playing with me. I'm really busy. She be trying to front because Charles never, they never be praying and stuff. And then now she's looking like this. She thinks she can bully people. She still need that skin, dude. They met our Santana and Candy Birds. Why I say this? Mm-mm. Yeah, and the face tune is real. Like, y'all can't tell me that's Miss Nelly. No, and then, but they ain't putting no lotion on Charles' hand. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Charles, be <laughs> lotion. I'm weak. No, she usually say it right. Donald says it wrong. Mm-hmm. They got married. What? Yes. Yeah, I probably eat the leftovers for dinner. No, for real. <laughs> Because she don't show every meal, right? She'll just do one meal a day or something. This is the fourth. This is that is what she's famous for? The trials? Yes. Is ready. No, she cook it every day. This is the sixth. Then that's the fourth. The fifth. Then this is the fourth. That's the only videos? Like, it just be her cooking for him? Oh, now it's like, because they famous. But before, so that before, was just him. So they shot So he's a pimple on her chin? That's a piercing. Mm-hmm. So is she like, he's, Charles a special ed? Like, he's... You could tell Charles screws not loose. You gotta listen to him talk. Let me see when Charles go like, that. Mmm, that did good. Like what? <laughs> what? She's like, tell him again, Charles. Okay. okay, she's scaring me. Let me see it up. 
You can speed it up like that? Yes. I love watching videos sped up. Why are you shaking? He be standing there outside the camera ready to all years. Amila K, I already announced my pregnancy. Oh, that's not you. Was that you who said that? Just traveling. Oh, get slapped. I announced it already on TikTok. I'm plus, I announced it on every app. Oh, yeah, he looks slow. Exactly. But he got a whole son in the line. Yeah. You see that food thing? He'll say, look, good. He'll say, every video. What happened to you today? He don't look like he like her. Yes, he can go captive. I think so. Amen. Hey. You know, you got that plastic fork again today, so you got to show them people today that you can still eat my steak with a plastic fork, baby. Like what? And then what if every time a video cut off, she took the plate away from Charles, and Charles really, really wasn't eating shit? <laughs> she be yelling at Charles. Yeah, that's what Charles. Got her. So, oh, mind you, she told oh, she came in there funny shape for Valentine's Day. Like what she had on was terrible. They got roses all on around, a little bag ran with dirt in it. And what? two wines, uh, bottles of Stella Rosa with the Dollar Tree chocolate in a bear mm -hmm. with petals on a bed. So, oh, Charles did all this. This must be a surprise. Meanwhile, Charles alone holding the camera. Thank you so much, Get Slapped. I put I put the short on uh, on YouTube so you can watch it on my channel here. But thank you so much. I don't know why I just be assuming everybody got like every social media, you know? So, yeah. <sighs> she treats him like he is her child. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she be doing Charles in. I feel bad. Not doing Charles in. Look, this is them at their wedding. Room. Uh, I read that. That's her dress. That's his suit. Okay. So who's doing the bending? I mean, instead of be Trina Charles, I think she's doing the bending. <laughs> Even though she's supposed to be the miss. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I don't like that all their um what do you call it? Their skits is Miss Netta mistreating women, but she wants to be a woman. I don't like that. She be mistreating women. Like that. Mm -hmm. So it's a skit, no Netta. Mm -hmm. This is Kimaye. Hi. I love when people spell my name right. The ghetto, I am pregnant again, and I'm finna join you right over there in the hood, cause baby, <laughs> that's what it's giving. You okay, mommy? You don't look okay. That's why I don't be getting a quick weeds, cause I feel like they itch hella quick for me. Oh, quick weed. Everything happens quickly with them, please. They say like quick weeds, you can't actually scratch up scalp. Girl, yes, you can. If you get a rat tail comb, mm -hmm. stick it right on under there. But it be feeling like hair's popping out your head, but I'll still do it though. It be feeling like that's you too? Yes. <laughs> I'm like, it don't feel right. <laughs> Not who's doing the bending is crazy. <laughs> I just be wanting to know. Because Miss Netta look big. But Charles, he don't really She look really like a... big at the top and small at the bottom. Miss Netta so bad, dude. Damn. She look like much, a SpongeBob. Yeah, you know, she don't mm -hmm. play. I've been seeing all the, and then her eye, how it be doing, and her teeth. Miss Nettle look nasty. <laughs> Damn, you chewing her up. <laughs> Not too much. Yeah, she gonna come get Kimaye, your dinner is ready. <laughs> <laughs> and you heard they song, cause Charles, your lunch is ready. If you had to live, if you had to pick, pick one, let's do this or oh that. Oh, God. Would you rather live with Miss Netta for mm -hmm. two weeks, and instead of Charles being there, you be the new Charles. <laughs> <laughs> or would you rather be Roland Ray's caretaker and change his diapers and everything? I feel like I need to be. Well, I'm gonna make my decision based off Imani. Which one are you picking? Because I can't. It's Roland fucking Ray. You changing his what? diapers? He all. Imani's a all. nurse though. She don't mind okay, changing diapers. Yeah, I'm gonna change diapers too. Because I don't know, Miss Netta look dirty, and I just feel like she put voodoo in Charles. Everything, food. everything Charles does with Miss Netta, you have to do. Yeah. <laughs> no. You love me there. Or, or, or you have to uh, babysit Roland Ray while he has a uh, COVID and a, and a diarrhea spell. <laughs> I'm a t uh well that don't mean I have to wipe his butt. He better. Now I'm gonna stay with Netta. Uh, no, y'all nasty because Netta puts voodoo on Charles' food and you have to do everything. How do you know that Charles puts voodoo do on Charles' food? Not boo boo voodoo. I said voodoo because Charles ain't in his right mind. He been in the hypnosis like on Get Out. 
Charles needs to get out. Right, your conspiracy theories are sick. You just thought you want to start on this one? I'm starting on the middle part. You want a middle or you want a smiddle? A smiddle. So no, a middle. I was being a smart ass. You gonna answer? <sighs> oh look, this time before one two lost one. Why look like she got one two? She kind of look like Young Thug. <laughs> she does. <laughs> Anybody know? She does. Happy birthday. I hate people who try hella hard to sing happy happy birthday. I think people that just try to sing hella bad is just sick. They said so this is before he kidnapped Charles without the raise above. Uh, happy mm. birthday to me. Thank you. Thanking yourself is crazy. You want edges? Uh, yeah, not a lot, though. Okay. Twin. Where have you been? <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Take Christmas out. That's really a song? Yes. Yeah, I know y'all want this relationship. It's sad, but it's true. Never. Nobody wants a relationship. What? Just wish you mind your business. <laughs> what? Charles, your lunch is ready. It's crazy. Charles, your lunch is ready. It <laughs> won't make me mad if Charles is eating dinner for lunch. Like, please. <laughs> Charles eating dessert for dinner. <laughs> He probably don't even eat dinner because all that shit, that's too much. He Breakfast probably be still and lunch. Cool. I know he just be on the toilet. That's hella food to be eating. And then she always make him something with bell pepper. I would be hella, stuff. I would be hella, uh, how do I do? I would be hella fat because, um, turn it down a little bit. Mm -hmm. Only if you're gonna play copyright music. Mm -hmm. Um, I used to be, I would be hella fat because when I eat hella food like that, I go right to sleep. Oh, Y'all be doing that? I did today after brunch and then my mom woke me up to clean up and I was so mad. Right, don't wake me up for that. Don't ever wake oh, me up. It's time to do that kitchen. No, it's time for me to go back to sleep. I hate when they do that. <laughs> a lot of time in the world, why you think when I'm in my my good old sleep? Could have did this before I was full. Now it's time to do that kitchen. Yeah, that kitchen can go to hell. <laughs> Burn it up, man. That's like the worst job to have is a kitchen. I'd rather have no, I the bathroom the or the living room. I love you like cleaning the bathroom, but I be getting a headache because I be killing myself with them chemicals. But I don't open That's the good. door. That means you get it in. Because I don't want to open the door because I don't want my siblings talking to me. I got my music on. And then I don't want to open the window because it'd be cold. So I actually. So what y'all rotate days? Near death. Uh, weeks now. It used to be days. And then my idiotic little brother messed that up. So why? Because he always leaving extra dishes left over with his dish day. Then he carry it to my sister. She's like, oh, I ain't washing that. That's hella petty. So you ain't gonna wash one fork because it's from No, Minnesota? he don't leave one fork. He leave five big pots. That had been had food stuck at the bottom oh, and don't even put water in. That's Kiev true. is trifling. Kiev is a hella cute name. I have to steal that. Yeah. Kyrie and Kiev. Kiev is hella cute. But I really oh. named him his name for real. Kiev? My I'm mom named him Kiev, but I named him Georgie and you always hear me refer to him as Georgie. Like everybody else. Georgie's so. weak though. Why do you call him Georgie? Because when he was born, I was trying to call him Dorothy from Nemo, but it was coming out like Georgie. And so I just kept calling him Georgie during my whole family. And now everybody like that he knows calls him Georgie. Most people don't know his name is Kiev. His own teammates and classmates didn't really know. Really? Mm -hmm. That's a hella cute name. And that's why, like, like on one of his football or, uh, pictures, it said Georgie Leslie. No, it like, didn't. Oh, is Georgie his middle name? No, Georgie's not his middle name at all. His name is Kiev Leslie. I just mm -hmm. like Georgie. That's crazy as fuck. Yeah, so I'll be telling him, you know, and it, oh, um, sir, <laughs> let me not. I gave you your whole identity. So. You one of them sisters. No, he's like one of them brothers. He annoying. Like, I'm trying to be on my bed and lay down and sleep. You come in my room, cut on lights and scream and to leave. Like, that will make me actually hurt you. And screams? Yeah, I don't like my, like, I don't like him playing with my sleep. Because he think it's funny to break people's sleep and stuff. No, see, that type of shit would piss me off. Yeah. But he think he funny, so I just be funnier. I know your house be in a ruckus. All the time. Mm -hmm. That's, That's what I gotta worry about with my kids. Oh, yeah, because y'all think they're gonna argue? Yeah, yeah they're gonna be the same age gap as me and my brother. Well, a little bit. How? Kai is what, one? He's gonna be a year and like nine months. Oh, me and my brother was two years and five months. But yeah. When they be close in age, ooh. 
We used to tussle all the time back when we was kids back in them days. Back in them days. I used to always have to put it on him. And then one day he low key beat me up. I'm like, all right. I <laughs> you know, it's all, it's okay, it's whatever. I don't want my kids to argue. Well, well they gonna argue, Bree. They siblings. They argue over stupid stuff too. So you're not gonna tell me that you move my controller from here to there? No, it's stupid. Then they just start yelling at me. Don't call her like, Be quiet. Guy. Stop, guys. Shut up. Don't say shut up, guys. <laughs> yeah, especially if you got a boy and a girl. Two boys, they gonna argue too, but they might be more like cool and kind of like cool with each other. Like, my Unless Kai always trying to be the one that's like, hey, I'm your big brother. Don't do that. <laughs> if you want to do it, they might argue a little bit. Boy, you only a year. That's why they, they think they way older. But no, it's just a year. My sister, she was like the babysitter from. Child, your booty yeah. red. <laughs> that's stuck in my head. And then she saw, oh, and then when she say, um, wait, I, I forget how the song go. Because Charles. <laughs> yep, my sister's red. I'm hella weak. Charles. I'm trying to find his wife. The internet is just a wild ass place, y'all. Y'all ever really think about that? Yes. Why is it showing all these stupid people? People are hella funny. I be thinking in my head, how do people think of skits? Like, it's just to be hella funny. Like, what's going on in your brain? <sighs> and yeah, they make candy berries. Like, Candy, why would you take a picture of Miss Nettie and Charles? Mm -hmm. And they have fan pages and all that. To support all people. What those shows is going on right now? Mm. Who else wasted their time and watched that stupid Baddies vs. Wild? Penny, you just wait until they're toddlers. The fighting is going to be crazy because they don't want to share. I don't think, no, they're not going to do that, y'all. They're going to love each other. I've seen this video of these toddlers fighting. It was so funny. Am I being unrealistic? Yeah. Possibly. Actually, extremely. No, don't fight, kids. Just stand in the middle and say, hey, stop now. And then they'll stop, possibly. Then if not, you will have, that's when you pull out the whippings. <laughs> the whippings. <laughs> they gonna it's stop whippings, then. fool. Not the whippings. They really gonna stop. My grandfather used to call it a lashing. Mm -hmm. sure. A lashing? That really sounds like slavery. Lash? That's what they call it, lashes. I remember when I was watching Django and he said Hildy got lashes on her back and I was from a slave whip. <laughs> lashes? Wow. <laughs> lashes? Wow. Some people yeah, say, that's stuck in my uh, head now. Charles, your booty's red. They hating on... I'm trying to figure out who's hating on Charles. What happened to the chat on the screen? They ain't talking about nothing. Oh. Just yet, just right now. <sighs> you might, you got to show me the picture again because um, it's on my phone and, you know, we're using it right now. Oops, my bad. Mm -hmm. My bad, Charles. My bad, Charles. Mm. <laughs> Charles blinks slow. He do everything slow. Except for when they eat. When Miss Nettie be making him eat fast, she's like, oh, taste this. So I'm like, she literally stands over him with the hands on the chair, like, watching him yeah, eat. Yeah, she be abusing him. Yeah, I feel bad for Charles. I know Nettie be putting them hands on him. Somebody told Uncle Netta that you got raised with him. Like, Uncle Netta? That's crazy. <laughs> Uncle Netta? His real name is Joe. He looked like a Joe. <laughs> he said, told some happy birthday to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak. That's sick as hell. That was sick. Wait, let me see you one more time. Wait, wait, wait. I think I got it. Y'all, I'm following the designer. You know, I'd be liking my shit to be to the T. I wonder if Charles ever eat out at restaurants. It's a baby in my stomach, y'all. That's hella crazy. Y'all think it's Regina? No, you're being pranked. Being pranked is crazy. You think I would get canceled if I faked a whole pregnancy? Yes. No, people do it to stop a guy from leaving in toxic relationships and I still be together. He just bash her on social media. You I did it for your attention, my love. My love is crazy. 
He'd be like, it's all right. That's getting a legion. Now he'd be all right. Well, like on social media, he'd be cussing her out, but in real life, he'd be like, it's all right, princess. You watched the uh, recent Tisa story, Kimai? The recent who? Risa Tisa. No, what's that? It sounds good. What? What's Risa Tisa? I'm surprised you don't know. It's a 50 part TikTok series. You didn't see that about the. Oh, who did I marry? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was funny. You watched it? I watched like a few parts. My best friend was really just telling me it because it was a lot to watch. I'm like, girl, please just throw it on YouTube, then I'll watch it. That would be good. But so he was lying to her about buying the house. Mm hmm. He was he brought fake people no fake people as his parents. He went to fake graves. Mm -hmm. What? Yes, talk about this my mom and my site. dad. Oh, he didn't even know that he used to work there, so he knew of a, a so, grave site that said John and Jane. He knew security sometimes. He worked at a football area. All this crazy stuff, and I'm like, so you, you really, went to these edges or just uh, yeah the side right school too? Yeah, yeah, you really went to random people graves. Talk about they overseas parents. Where's your real parents at now? Because we I think have he said it was his grandparents. Oh, either way, that's sick. And his grandparents probably somewhere living. No, they're dead. Oh, but it ain't the people watching. Why you but he just was lying. Actually. Like he acted. I think he acted like his grandma died recently, but it died a long time. I still haven't watched yet. I'm gonna watch Zoe. Watch it. It's on YouTube too. Uh, did he do like a reaction? I feel like he'll be hella funny to watch it. Like a reaction of you. Y you watch uh, Messy Mondays, Kimai? I uh, used to. Mm -hmm. I fell off, but not like too bad. I can. I can still watch. You can still uh, get back on. Yeah. I've been watching lately though, caught in the act, cheaters with Tammy Roman. Oh yes, something that I be feeling like be staged. Yeah, I, I do too. Like I watched the first one with the sugar daddy, and I don't know. Yes, I seen that one. The one where the dude had like he was messing around with four women at the same time. Yeah, that one was one one stage. And then he said that he got his heart broken in the sixth grade, and all three out of them women had been pregnant by him before. Actually, I don't know if that one gets staged because, like, I don't know, some of the women was kind of showing real emotion, mm -hmm. so it's hard but to But you're getting your heart broken in sixth grade is crazy. <laughs> what does that have to do with this? So you watch the whole new season? Uh, no, I just be... I only watch the first one. Cl clicking on stuff. Like, how my YouTube TV is set up, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I just be watching them. But some of them, like, It'd be random. see me. Yeah, they do be seeing the stage, and I really don't like that. I seen the one with the uh, gay guy, and he was like... The dance studio yeah. one? Yeah, yeah, that one was funny. That one was hella funny. <laughs> that one was funny, and the one with the gay girl that was, was hella funny, funny too. Yeah. I gotta get back on all my shows though. Catfish, <laughs> Fresh Forty Eight. Right, I don't know how people still getting catfish. Is there a new season? I don't know. I haven't been. watched Catfish since it like be. I used to watch it with my best friend. And getting catfish, I said getting cash. <laughs> getting catfish in twenty twenty four, you deserve it. They have face filters though, and voice to. Hello, baby. The whole time they sound like you would know because you're a professional catfisher. I ain't did no voice to him yet, though. I'm yet? yet. It's crazy. Yet? It's sick. Oh, no. It's 2024. I'm supposed to be getting to life. No more catfishing. But I'm still going to watch the show. I want you to be on the show so damn bad. I know. Dying. But I want to catfish like a family member I that know. I don't like. You'd be like, I don't know, me. I'm addicted. <laughs> so you're going to be like that dude in the Kelly Price episode. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna catfish my cousin's side piece because I don't like her. Yo, Keyword: She's a side piece. piece, and you know I'm I'm, I'm I'm down for my cousin's wife. So they've been married for 45 me? years. Cousin's wife, and you know the side piece? He brings her around everywhere. So him and his wife, they've been like broken up, but it's only because he was cheating on her. Mind you, he's 60, same age as my granny. It's her nephew, but they're a year apart. <laughs> um, same age as the side piece. I mean, no. What am I saw? Yeah, he's the same age as my granny, long story short. He was cheating on his wife with the side piece, mind you. Him and his wife been married since my dad was born. My dad is 47 years old. So, they, um, he was cheating on her. She found out. She tried to forgive him. He kept messing with her. She left. He literally in with the side piece, grandkids now, buying her dogs and all this. My granny and him say he's staying around because she's supposed to have a lump sum of money coming in. But she's not gonna get the lump sum money. It's not like a Tyler Perry. My great auntie said he not gonna get the lumps. She not gonna get the lump sum of money because she keep taking loans out of it. My great auntie don't like her, which is his auntie. My granny don't like her, which is his auntie. And then his mama, backstory, she is the mother of is four this boys. Is he supposed to be telling? Um, I don't really care. Uh, she's good. good. <laughs> she's, good. Good. <laughs> she's the mother of four boys, and her oldest son is my cousin Leon. Rest in peace. Uh, he. <laughs> He had uh, five kids, three baby mom, four, four, 
Mm-hmm. Hold on, wait. Three baby mamas, and one of them, she uh, she wasn't supposed to be baby. He had two kids with each baby mama, but the one in the middle, she was a whoopsie. She was supposed to be working for the family and got her pregnant. Anyway, <laughs> that doesn't fun? matter. <laughs> what? Um, yeah, so that so long story short, she has like a lot of daughter in laws because she got four sons, and the other ones in bed with women too. They all still come by and visit and love her and love this and all that, and she just oh, loves them all. I'm telling you, she just takes it in and she loves it. So she um she likes the side piece. Well, and likes side piece. I feel like my cousin, the one my granny's nephew that has the side piece, he still think he living his life like he's young. So I think I'm gonna find his social media, but I don't like wanna get into no freaky and talk or nothing. That's my cousin. I'm just gonna be like, hey babe, let's meet up. Cause I don't wanna get into no weird nasty stuff. And he's gonna get embarrassed on catfish and hopefully his side piece leaves him. Amen. You, know, you gonna sign your letter too? Yeah, but if you find out that his little cousin catfished him, him and my dad's relationship never going to be the same. <laughs> but, I mean, I don't care. I want to catfish cheaters. Like, seek help. Why okay. are you trying to be the Spider-Man of catfish? She, be, she <laughs> Last time we were talking about her catfish, she's talking about, but I do it to men who are sick and who do this and do that. Like, yes, you are not Captain Sable. a certain type of man. Who remember Kim Aya saying she was, was going to send a bunch of pieces to her ex house like a year ago. I'm weak. Yes. Oh my God. Why did you bring that back up? Because he really just been bothering me lately. Okay, that's you know, like we don't communicate, but his presence has really been grinding my gears lately. Something is going on. Um, I don't know what's going on. Would you ever take him back? Never in a million years. I'd rather let somebody I love die before I take him back. Damn. <laughs> I don't even want to say how close, but just know close. So, you know, um, Please don't say how it goes, because I don't want you wishing dead on none of your family. I love that. Um, I'm not suffering like that again ever in the rest of my life. I should have like 12 gray hairs by now. Mm. Let me see the picture. What you know? Is he dating somebody else? No, he's back hooking up with the girl before it. <laughs> he ain't dating nobody, you know. He just likes to do yeah. the little pleasurable things. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, he did steal her a flower from Walgreens. I guess you could call that romantic <laughs> <laughs> for Valentine's Day. A stolen Day. rose is sick of Yeah, hell. he couldn't even pay for the rose. But I mean, How do you know he stole it? Because him and my my, be- they, my best friend and her cousins was there. And he was there. He's friends with one of her cousins. Long story short, it's like a group of 10 kids there at Walgreens in the morning and for Valentine's Day. And he just walked out with his rose. Mm. While everybody else stood in the line and paid because they actually care for their others. A significant others he thought stealing her rose would keep her coming over and of course it would even if he didn't get her anything she would still come over because she's just very stupid what? fuck stop texting me oh i'm texting you huh? i'm a stalker <laughs> oh the i have to tell you about read my lips yes oh my god y'all read no i saw her at the funeral uh, wow. and she just was like oh my god <sighs> Like, excited to see you. Like, really excited. Oh, my God. I missed you so much. Like, why? Okay. God bless. <laughs> and that will be my time to turn around and leave. Mm-hmm. This is hella disrespectful. That's for real little. <laughs> it said many, but I didn't know it meant that many. But that's good for, like, a diet. Oh, shit, y'all. Mm. Mm-hmm. You got all your egg rolls? Huh? Not I'm pregnant too, Panna. Why is all y'all pregnant? What the hell? It's in the air. Let me put this one back in. July 27th, yes. Who doesn't want to be on title? Me. Me. Hey, Monty, come on. You got to be on my side. No. Do you hear how you sound? I'm like amazing. Everybody loves me. I do love you. I really love you, but mm mm-mm. No. No. I think you should do it. I love you, but not full time in my household. <laughs> not full time. I thought you said you wanted to take me in for boot camp. I did not take you in. I don't need boot camp no more though. I'm saved. Like I'm very good. <laughs> you are not saved. Did you get baptized? I pray more now. <laughs> That's a start. No, I really pray every night, y'all. I used to not pray every night. One thing I do gotta work on though is praying over my food because I'm sorry. When they get in front of me and I'm hungry, I'm gonna pray as I'm eating in my mind. I ain't even gonna say it. it, it it's too good. That you can wait twenty seconds to thank the but Lord. But think about it: like if the food, minute. if the meat is undercooked, you praying over it, not gonna stop you from getting food poisoning. You it still go get sick. Like. Okay, but oh, I don't know, Jesus. I be hungry. I the be Lord knows hungry. my heart. To say thank you, Lord, for this food. Never, never. 
All you gotta do is say Jesus wept. Amen. Literally at all my family events, they be trying to stand. But I hate now they stand and pray over the food before people start getting their plates. But I miss when everybody used to get their plate and everybody everybody got their plate. Now let's say grace. While everybody head down and their eyes closed, I'm biting. I'm chewing quietly so my grandma don't see me. <laughs> But yeah, I don't keep my already. But you gotta eat stuff where it don't make an indent. Like don't bite the chicken leg. Eat some yams, yeah, some macaroni. They ain't gonna know. Keep my <laughs> So when did you get saved and how? I would love love to know your story. I don't know. Twenty twenty four. I just so I was just, tired of you suffering. You just woke up on January first feeling delivered. Yes, I just felt like I could just scream and shout. <laughs> so ever since then, I just no, I feel like I can just scream and shout. Do you go to church? No, I'm not a fan of church because you know what? I don't like that people say that you can only serve God in, on Sunday in his house. You can never not serve God. As long as you're dedicating your time and your thoughts to him, Preach you for serve God. God, okay? So I'm not going to wake up early on Sunday when yes. I can get in my bed and listen to the old ladies in their hats yes. and get hungry when I can pray all day say that shit. and listen Let's to the music. Mm, I stop myself. I said so. shit. Yeah, y'all won't catch me in the church unless it's um, a wedding. I'm only going to Tacky Tabernacle. Well, and what is that? Tacky Tabernacle you, uh, is fast. That's when you don't got to dress up. I don't do them churches where you got to be in your Sunday's best. Oh, yeah. Um, if I can't come in jeans, I ain't going. The church I used to go to, they used to tell us, um, come as you are. Exactly. That's my fa that's my favorite. That's but Tacky some people Tabernacle. took that too far, coming in as they are with dresses, no panties, and they see through. Well, God what? don't mean that. No oh, panties yeah. in front of the Lord is sick. <laughs> But I mean, he already know what you got. He made you customly. Customly is But crazy. I'm trying to figure out did God being put all this stomach on me or I did that. That's <laughs> 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 I really want to know. I have a problem. Um, you did that. Nibbling <laughs> on your food before you say your damn grace. That's, That's why he put them extra pounds on you. He said, oh yeah, for Kimaya, I'm going to make this shit stick. <laughs> I'm so weak. Yeah, it's not clickbait. I'm really pregnant. <sighs> <laughs> I'm weak. Yeah, so I mean, I, I will Not go to church. God put the cage on me, or did I do that? That's hella funny. That's hella funny. I've never been baptized, but I got christened. My sister got baptized. But my mama said the preacher didn't hold me when I was a baby because as soon as he grabbed me, like, I started screaming and stuff. Mm -hmm. So my mom held me. He was like, oh, I don't even want to touch her. Um, what's that supposed to mean? Do your job. Not do your job. job. Like, you making me feel like an antichrist or something. He did his job and reduced your ass. <laughs> and look how you turned out. <laughs> he didn't do it right, I guess. No, oh, but I don't know. The baptizing thing, I'm happy I got Christian because I don't know. Being dumped in the water, like, I don't know if the water's it's not clean or not. Water. It's just dipped. And the other thing is, I have stage fright. I don't want to do that in front of everybody. Baptize me when it's just me and a preacher. Girl, it's hella quick. They do it in front of the church, and everybody be like, yes, Kimai, and snapping cameras, and I'm all wet, hair fuzzy. <laughs> no. That's why you do it with braids. Let me get a clothes change, like, right Thank now. Thank you. Not let me get a clothes change right <laughs> now. And they do it in a white gown. I told my, well, my sister told me, because she don't like my ex. Like, she hate him real bad. She want to cause bodily harm to him. She said that if I marry somebody, she don't like uh, 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 That's assault. <laughs> Forgive me. Um, if I marry somebody, she don't like she wearing black to my wedding. Oh, and that's fine. Just don't show up. But send a gift. Not just don't show Please. up. But send a gift is crazy. Yeah. Oh, my God. And he knew that my sister didn't like him. So it just used to be so awkward. Like, when not we were each other. Now she would have caused bodily harm to him. She really don't like him. Oh, my God. I mean, I understand her. Oh. I care. Like, I'll let people do more to me than they can do to my parents or my siblings, you know, or somebody I care about. Like, if somebody was to do all that to her, like, I would hate them too. So, I mean, I guess she's not being too serious. But at the same time, Kiara is, like, really protective for no reason. <sighs> I need to drink some water. Bye, Bye, <laughs> <Bye -pee. laughs> You want this? Uh-uh. That was one of my clients from a week ago. <laughs> and it's still here. Let me see the, the uh, picture. Uh, sorry, I'm almost done. After this, I don't even need to see it again. Them look the fuck good. Do they? Yes, Bobby. Yes, Bobby. That's why I'm Mariah the scientist on that jail call. Bang daddy. Baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, girl. Buki, am I your stylist? Somebody said, Am I your baby? If that call got leaked, I would be like really embarrassed. I would take a break from social media. We all got stuff we say to our significant others, like some little freaky weird shit. Yeah, but I just actually, I don't, but 
I can see people having it. I'm a Barbie girl. Did I say put that picture down? Oh, whoopsies. In a Barbie world. For some reason today, my hair is, my head is not hurt at all. Like, I'm not tender-headed, but sometimes I feel like a little, like, this has just been, like, normal the whole time. Mm -hmm. I'm think my parents think about moving to LA. Yes. I hope they do because I really want to live in LA. Like, I've been saying that since I've been a kid. You'd be great for LA. You might even end up on a sitcom. <laughs> oh my god. That's like so cool. I want to be on um I want to run the catfish thing. Like I want to be <laughs> the one of those people. I would love to. I actually feel like you would show. be a hella good co-host. I would be like, yeah. so why? What possessed you to do this? this what if they say the same thing that possessed you, Lisa? Be like, um, no, I don't know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, because like that one dude, he was catfishing people, and he met up, and it was a dude. He was like, so you're gay? He said, no, I just don't like cheaters, man. So I found out you had a wife. Oh, I was on you. Like what? what? That was a catfish episode. Yes. Yeah, so this dude, he got catfish men, women. He not gay or nothing. He just don't like cheaters. You, he found out you were in a relationship. He's catfishing you and meeting up with you. What? It's so he's, so, so you're not you by yourself. This? Why would you do this to your spouse? I got the idea from him when I was like twelve. Wait, this was a real catfish episode. When I was like twelve, it's great. What the heck? Mm -mm. Come on, Barbie. Let's go, Barbie. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, yeah. My baby one. I was pregnant with Panda in 2022. Okay, get pregnant again, Frank. Come on, Riri. Uh -uh, uh -uh. <laughs> I wish pregnancy on you and don't rebuke it. A lot of people be one and done, but that's because they have a bad experience. But maybe this time you won't have a bad experience. That's why well, the experience is already. But I'm like, if you time. have two and you have a bad experience with both, please don't get pregnant with a third. Now you just you want to end it all. Like, I'm not going to keep risking myself I like actually, that. My experience with Kai was not bad at all. I mean, it was like a, a scary delivery, I feel mm -hmm. like. But really, like, looking back, it wasn't that bad. Yeah. Mm. You know, everything is always, like, hella in the moment. And then you look back and you're like, uh. And I thought when people water break, they, like, rush to the hospital. No, some people don't even be that dilated when they water break. don't always break. My water didn't break. Ooh. And I heard about this thing that they call the balloon that breaks your water for you, but they said like get it induced, it like hurts way worse. Yeah, it's so if the baby just not gonna come, give me a cesarean. I don't care if I'm forty two weeks. Don't put no balloon. Forty two weeks is crazy. No, that's okay. when they start eating their own, you know. Poop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They able to poop and stuff. Then once you get like you want to get when you See, y'all, I really thought I was going to be married by, engaged, senior year, married by 23. Excuse, Excuse me? This is not the 1950s. Yeah, but this is what I thought when I was like 12. I thought I was going to be engaged, senior year, married by 23, have a kid at 25, 26, and 28. I mean, technically, I will you say still when be married. Young, like, when I, was young, when I was I don't really younger, married. I was like, by 24, I'm going to do this, that, this. I never said It don't go that way. way. It no, didn't. I did. No. I was like, by 24, I'm going to be married. I'm going to start having a kid mm -hmm. if I want one. I said all this about my career, so. I, I was always like, yeah, I'm about to be set by this day. I'm going to have money for this. I'm going to do like, this. Like, life just goes as planned. No, as you get closer to the years, you start, like, oh knowing God. some of that shit. Yeah, it's I was never, I never, <laughs> I fantasized about, like, having a family, but not really. Like, I wasn't that girl. Like, I was just like, yeah, yeah. I can't wait to be set. Literally yeah. going, buying what I want. Not, like, irresponsible, but just living, like, the life I really want to live. I don't want to be married anymore. I don't want children. It's mm -hmm. just... I'm gonna be married. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna be married. married. Mm -mm. I, don't, I can't be no. married. I'm not gonna marry nobody if I know they're gonna cheat on me. This is my life. sixth no. child. You don't Baby, marry call anybody the police. Who you think is gonna cheat? I know, but you can't never do put 110% mm -hmm. trust in nobody. Yes. No, I can't. You can't I just anymore. know the like braid and stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah, is it just me or on your period? Like, your armpit sweat faster. On my period, I be getting musty fast. I have to put extra deodorant on my period, and that's nasty. But I'm 157 days late on my period anyway. Excuse so. me? I am. 157? <laughs> I am. Mm. I got <laughs> That's just fat. That's that French toast belly. That French yeah, toast yeah. belly is crazy. <laughs> they said, oh, girl, you most definitely pregnant. I said, oh, no, I'm not. I got an implant. No what way. is an implant? Implanon? Yeah, the next one on. And they shoot a hole in your Can I make up implanon? 
You was and close, I still so got we'll give you the benefit of the doubt. It's a big old scab. And like it healed, but it's still like a black hole. And then they have to take it out. Like it's just all gonna be a hole in my arm. I don't like that. <laughs> I just wanna look cute and live my best life. And it's like not happening right now. But you it's need some... to just buy a new wardrobe. That's the mm -hmm. first thing. And then we got some other babies. Go outside. Like, you right. But don't go like outside because these people be crazy actually. You just go on like a friend. Yo, why don't I have no neck? Is it because I'm fat or is it just yeah. because? That's because how you sit in. No, I don't think I have one. That's okay if you don't. From Mobile, Alabama. I thought they were saying I'm Can you put a hand on your neck? Barely. I got, I got a My hand's hands. big. But yeah, I can fit my hand on my neck. I don't have no neck. Bring my me. head is back though. It's okay. Most people don't. <laughs> Most people don't. It's crazy. I just want to make her. I'm gonna start sitting like this. Do you know they have neck extension surgery? Oh, they put plates in your neck. Need a break. Take a break, Queen. Yeah. You did really good though. So I could go take one of them long breaks real quick. You know, um, yeah. Go do what you gotta do. I gotta yeah. take a break, y'all. It's. Um, you doing good, oh, oh, shit. You got you got through Carwees. You got through the two people. Oh God. Oh, you got, you got I had to sit down, y'all. Oh, what is cute. that? Oh, oh, my bad. I sat on the controller. You like it? Yeah, I like this. I seen it on some random ladies' Instagram. It only had like ten likes. Really? Let me see. Yeah. I might have to switch up the side part just a little bit. Okay. But it's it's damaged. Are you still on some water? She blurting out red, random stuff. I'm weak. She blurt, blurting out random stuff. Who? Me? Yes. Can you give me some water with ice, please? Imani, you want some too? Wash yes, your please. foot. Go wash your foot. Get, uh, there you go. Thank you, Queen. Damn. I'm sorry, y'all. I had to take a little, a little breaky break. I've been going hard today. I did one, two, three, four. This is my fifth client. What time is it? 8.35. Damn. <sighs> yeah, see, that's why I, that's why I tried to move beyond my because I was like, I don't know. Oh, baby, yeah, you wasn't going to make it. I didn't, I forgot it was the third and Kimaya was coming. That's so why I was like, wait, you got room for one more person. I mean, if you want to gas through it. But well, nah. really, it was the two. It was, uh... The two that I put in, the two older couple, the older couple, mm -hmm. and they're going to LA tomorrow, so they couldn't move, you know. Yeah. Um. But I do feel bad. Yeah, I just had to sit down for a second, y'all. I've been going nonstop. I didn't really. I mean, actually, before Kimaya, I got to sit down for like thirty minutes, but you know that'd be going by quick. Yeah. So. I just needed to sit down real quick and do a little reset. And tomorrow I'm back at it. I got hella clients tomorrow. I might actually need help. Um, I wish I wasn't going to school. I would have to tell me. I know, it's okay. I might have to resort to Donald. <laughs> resort is funny. <laughs> I love Donald, y'all. Don't get me wrong. He's hella pretty. He's just like a badass kid. This yeah, year I want to get I want to get prettier this year. I gotta figure out how to Me do too. That. I wanna get prettier too. When we gonna start? I don't know, bitch, because life is kicking my ass, so not me too. Y'all, I cannot be cute right now. Like I just I can barely do life right now. We just need to you just need to get your lashes done. Every time you get your lashes done, like yo, like you feel a little better. That's why I'm doing a so that's why I'm doing a maintenance uh vlog, y'all, because I feel like actually when I get my makeup done, not my makeup, when I do my makeup or like get my hair done and stuff, I do feel better about myself, but it's the act of actually like getting all that done you know like it's yeah. just a lot it's just a lot i'm drained right now um i'm just tired you know so it's toka boca i'm not really overworking myself right now i'm doing like what i can mm -hmm. um you know yeah i'm doing what i can when i can so but Tuesday, I'm going to do a maintenance vlog, y'all. I'm getting my nails done. <sighs> I'm going to try to get my lashes done. 
I just gotta really get my life together. Yeah. Just so I can feel better about myself. <sighs> I think I need to use the bathroom. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna let y'all know. This pregnancy, I'm not gonna be telling you what to do. Please don't. <laughs> Even though I know y'all love me, y'all not gonna do that to me this time. Because my last pregnancy with Kai, sit down, Penny. You need to stop. But I will say this pregnancy, I'm actually taking off two months for my maternity leave. So. And she gonna stick to it. I, well, I don't have no choice, bitch. I'm not gonna have nowhere to do here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm leaving the salon in July, guys. So, this will be my last couple months here. You pay five, five weekly? I pay five forty a week. That's hella money. It is. So, the thing is, is like, so my lease is up here in July, and I'm not renewing it only because I'm going to be on maternity leave. So, like, I plan to go on maternity leave at the beginning of August. So, August, September... Um, I won't be working and then I'm probably gonna take at least four months off for the baby like I might do hair here and there but I also think this next c-section might be a little bit harder because it's gonna be my second one but um thank you so much um but I was gonna say I didn't want to sign another lease because I have to sign for a year so that's gonna be at least six months with me not working and paying two thousand dollars a month to not be here the only way it would make sense is if I sublet it. But the thing that's hard is a lot of braiders don't have a license. Thank you, Queen. So, who am I going to sublet it to? My eyes not breaking. Woo! Who else thirsty? I knew you wasn't taking six months off, though. Oh, shit. No, I'm, I'm, I do plan. So, I, I plan to take two months off for the beginning just because, y'all, this pregnancy has been harder for me and... I only work if I have to. Yeah. I had three six sections. That was pretty smooth. Okay. Were they all the same? Or did you feel yeah, like the second and well, third one were a little harder? I had three six sections. Really? Mm-hmm. I thought you only could get like two. No, you go, they said you could only get No, three. I think three. But my mom co-worker had four. Damn. And my mom didn't know that. She said she would have had another baby if you know. Which is kind of crazy. Yeah, crazy. Your mom said that? Mm-hmm. How many your mom had? Three. She has C-section for all of us. She wanted more kids. I would guess. My daddy wanted five. Oh no. What the fuck? Of course, the men always want more because they don't really have to put it into work. Yeah. Yeah. My last one because my daughter was seven pounds. All my kids six weeks early. Dang. I've had three C-sections as well. Really? I have a lot of wearing. Has anybody I'm had here. a V-back? Oh, vaginal. Because my um. My uh, my doctor's like you might want to think about it, and I was like, no, I don't actually. Should I eat these hot fries? No. Come on. Like no. no. After no. Please. Oh, this is from. I'm on a diet. Let me get a spicy Dorito. Forty-five. Now she just ate the Rice Krispie treat. Talking about, I'm on a diet. <laughs> these still, they was open. That's okay. I like stale chips. They still for real? Yeah. There's another bag in there though. Please, I need to eat a hot fry. Oh. You're gonna grow up. So no. What is the D in chips? They're more smooth because you're prepared. prepared Don't eat them damn chips. Mm -hmm. Huh? No. You're gonna be sick, bitch. No. I don't wanna be a player no more. <coughs> Be yeah. If you could be any profession and like you automatically could swap what you're doing right now and be that profession and you could pick anything you want to be, what would you pick? Mm. And like whatever profession you are, you would be good at it. Not necessarily the best, but you'll go in being good. Mm. What profession would you pick? Mm.
psychology. And like you instantly know everything for it, like everything. Mmm. Okay. Fuck. I'll be a baseball player. Really? I'll turn into a man. MLB. No, I, I can't do that. You can't tra- you can't change your gender. I'll probably be uh I would probably be I'll be a singer so I'll get rich fast. Mm. You be what? A singer or a rapper? I get rich fast. Yeah, I'll probably be a singer too. Cause I already know what I would do and I could perform well on stage. I might be a model. A model? Okay. Is Lori Harvey model or? Like a Kendall Jenner model. Probably like a Lori Harvey. Mm-hmm. What would y'all be? I'm a phlebotomist right now. I would switch to being a singer. Oh, a surgeon a actually? Because I'm going to be rich and famous. Everybody needs to know who I am or I'm not satisfied. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I don't know. I need to be rich and famous. I'm weak. You want to be you want to be famous, heck of bad? Yes. Really? I feel like I'll be really nice to people. I'm not like a celebrity. Like, ew. <laughs> I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm sorry. You start dropping girls on me. Architect. No, Bri. I'm not going for it. You and this baby got to go. Cause this is sick as fuck that you up here eating this key lime pie with your fingers. <laughs> <laughs> you a fucking animal. Well, anybody want a piece? <laughs> so she stay back. I mean, um, that's I, hella, I even got the crust in there. That's hella <laughs> sick, bro. Come on. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Want a bite? Ew, not hair on it. Ew. That's sick as fuck. No. Mm. You gotta get away from me because I'm finna throw up. Zero out of five. What assignment is he talking about? <laughs> <laughs> like, you got a zero out of five? Yeah, but I have a, a B plus in his class. I do every assignment. Why don't you have an A? Um, because he gave me a 40 out of 50 on my current event assignment, which is a B minus. And he said, because your current event wasn't so current. Thank you. That's literally what the note on Power School says. Like, what was your current event? Roe versus Wade. <laughs> <laughs> what? But he introduced the assignment in 2023. And now, oh, it's not current. That's not current. I was like, who you ago? Oh, and I have an F01 assignment too. That's part of the reason I have a B Why? in this class. Because I didn't do it. I didn't understand it. So I said, oh, no, thank you. <laughs> and you know what? A lot of people is getting on my bad way. Life works. He posts assignments. And, you know, he has like five classes a day. Only 20 students are doing them. And he's like, oh, I'm just going to count for extra credit. Or, oh, I'll go over with it. You guys, yeah, I, that's what I thought. Because your assignment's too hard. That's why only 20 of your students doing them. And they doing them wrong. So, I mean, so weak. now every time I know, I say, oh, I'm not going to do this. I say, did you do it? Did you do it? Did you do it? They all say, no. I'm like, okay, well, he going to change it to extra credit. Or he going to do it with us. I ain't going to lie. That's how it be at my school. If we all fail to test, they be like, oh, they gonna, they going to curve the grade. And yeah. what they do, curve that motherfucking grade. Because don't nobody understand. Because clearly, did we fail or did the teacher fail? Oh, my God. Oh, shit. I almost dropped her key line pie. <laughs> oh, my God. That literally would have been a fist fight. <laughs> Assault and battery. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Because you just committed the, uh, what did you commit? Battery? I just committed assault. Uh, no, no assault is when you touch people. You commit a battery. No, no. battery is when you touch people. Battery assault is just to say it. Oh, you just committed Learn assault. that in school, y'all. The way you can remember it is when you put a battery in somebody's back, they don't go. <laughs> but <laughs> but assault. That's, that's not always the case because on Chucky, he ain't had no batteries in his back and he been on go. <laughs> and Annabelle, she ain't even move. I'm so fucking. Dead. I need you to turn your imagination on. <laughs> Woo. All five of my births of vaginal. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Five? God Why would bless. You five kids? Yeah, I don't know. Prayers to you, my Why queen. would you do that five times? Didn't that burn? <laughs> they told us this is one stage when you have a vaginal birth called a ring of fire. Well, it'd be burning. Yes. Wait. I don't want that. Wait. Like this fire. One of my aunties, she was like, ooh, that shit felt good. Somebody was like, what? my other auntie was I'm like, ready. you the type that like to be fisted. Because, bitch, that do not feel that good. That felt good. good. She was like, when it burned a little bit, it felt kind of good. <laughs> she was sick. We was all sitting there like, what? she was oh, like, you nasty That's just fuck. you. 
She was like, you're nasty as fuck. I have five and I have one on the way. Oh, oh, excuse oh, me. What's the fuck? Six kids? What is the Blood reason? Blood and Karen's. Mm-hmm. What is the reason? Because like they would say, when you have kids, you can't never just have like a day where it's like, no. And I have a, a no day every day, so I'm lazy. So that's why I don't want kids. When I feel like when they're young, you can't have a no day. When they get older, you definitely can. As soon as you hit seven, if I'm not getting up, go make some Once Kai can make his own noodles, that's, you that's might it. as well kiss my ass goodbye. Because <laughs> you don't even got to stay up for the other baby because Kai just going to make the other baby noodles. Exactly. That's sick as fuck. <laughs> What? Go watch, it's go just watch a couple brother. of noodles. He's not raising the kid. Shit, I can't wait. Mm. <laughs> as soon as he could uh, pop popcorn. <laughs> Kai, your dinner is ready. <laughs> 30, heat it up. The only thing is a minute and 30. <laughs> no, you wrong. Wait till that last pop. You nice and full. <laughs> Shit. Mm. It happens when the head comes out. No, it's so quick though. Once the shoulders pass that fire over. Like, okay, what I'm going to try to do is measure your baby's shoulders when they come out and try to understand the concept of how shoulders fit out of that little hole down there. <laughs> it stretches out. Like, oh no, baby, my, my auntie tore forward, my granny tore backwards. That's all I gotta say. And my granny had a third degree tear. Mm, my dad was nine pounds. Mm-hmm. What the fuck? Poor granny, every time he give her attitude, <laughs> I be feeling bad because all she done been through. <laughs> that like, was 40 years ago. Granny don't remember that. <laughs> dang near 50. Granny remember that shit. <laughs> Granny remember that. No, I did ask her. I said, do you know what time my dad was born to a while? I remember that. That was 50 years ago. <laughs> so sometime in the morning. Sometime in the morning, Granny. Is you for real? It's 12 hours in the morning. I don't I even mean, remember when Kyle was born. I think he was born in 920, actually. Bitch, it's on your fucking thing in your house. When you walk in. That don't mean I remember it. It's not in my brain. I can't remember <laughs> that. That was a whole year ago. A whole year. That's so long, right? Oh, no, it is, y'all. Childbirth is an amazing thing. It does seem beautiful. I will say that. Will I ever partake in it? No. But I salute people who do partake in it. Period. You think Kai gonna be jealous of the baby? He's so young. He's gonna be so. jealous. Uh, he gonna be excited. I, I feel like. I don't think so. All he gonna remember is that having a sibling. So yeah, he's not gonna remember life yeah. alone. I don't remember life alone. My sister told, oh, yeah, I, I remember when I was the only child. My brother. How you gonna remember life alone since you ain't never had life alone? Like you had an older sister when you were born. No, like remember being the youngest or the only child. Oh, okay. my sister was the only child, seven years. My brother always gonna be the youngest. I blinked, and I was an older sister. So yeah, Kai don't have that same like situation. He don't remember being the youngest or the only. He always gonna remember his sibling. Yeah, I haven't had a bad experience. I, I don't know what I'm having yet. Experience. They say rub fish oil down there, but be careful to get a yeast infection. <laughs> <laughs> and they say you won't rip if you rub the fish oil. Now they say you won't rip if you rub the fish oil, baby. <laughs> I'm not listening to no more old wise tales. Somebody, uh, my cousin grandma told me if I shave my legs with butter, with real butter, <laughs> their hair won't grow back. And I did that shit, and I'm still hairy <laughs> to this day. I'm not believing your not old wise tales. Shoot, rub shea butter in between your butt cheeks, and you won't tear, bitch. Well, rubbing Vaseline in between your butt cheeks does butthole stops after your butt stops your butthole from burning after hemorrhoid. <laughs> I mean, <you> know. <laughs> I didn't rip either, and I have my children naturally no meds. I salute you, Man, what? Do you um, do drugs? <laughs> no meds. That's that. crazy. Somebody Ashley. that that is not right in the head. They yeah. said me too, Ashley. Ashley, is your last name Hernandez? <laughs> Cause you with Jocelyn on that cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> I love cocaine. Give it to me, <laughs> <laughs> bro. That was her on that Baddies versus Wild talking about who got a line right now. Line it up. Let me take the first one. Like, ma'am. Everybody know I love cocaine. Okay. <laughs> like this. Way. Everybody know I love cocaine. Okay. I know what she was gonna ask. <laughs> who got it? She was. A, she was looking at the crowd. Who got it? Who got cocaine? Oh Girl. God. I had and y'all know what kills me? They say that fentanyl is in epidurals, y'all. Mm-hmm. Be careful. And then <laughs> the, the thing is, we in California. Stay your ass <laughs> off of Google and TikTok. <laughs> you know, if you move during the epidural, you can get paralyzed. Mm-hmm. Yes, say you ma'am, get in your know. epidural at Oakland Kaiser, mind you, <laughs> in California. Boom, earthquake. <laughs> now you can't walk the rest of your life, not because the doctor, but because the earth decided to quake during your epidural, and you leaving the hospital in a wheelchair, you can't walk out of. Not a blessing. That would be just a freak accident. It was your time if that happened. Think about how many people are going to be giving birth to in the Bay Area during an earthquake. 
I'm sorry. It was your time. It was your time. It's crazy. An earthquake. If an earthquake happens as soon as you getting stuck with your epidural, it was it was, your, it was your time. That was your fate. Shit, I have no legs. That's you. That's you. That is that was your fate. It was gonna happen whether it was the epidural or whether you fell down the stair and broke your legs off. And then some people say the epidural only work on one side. So one side you're feeling a burn, and the other side you don't feel nothing. No, some people. Some people don't feel nothing at all. Well, that's what it don't the, it don't work at all. Oh, all right, kick in late. That's what happened to my auntie when she had Gianna. It's traumatizing. I couldn't believe I was in a room to see a baby actually come out of the hole. I can't wait. That was scary. That's the I want to go. If it came on my butthole, I wouldn't yeah. trip. No, but <laughs> yeah, because sometimes when a big dookie gets released, it'd be you know, my good. friend he thought to tell me this weird science fact the other day. He's kind of weird that your butthole can stretch to the size of a raccoon's head. If you Google it, I wonder how he knows that. Um, you know, he's very strange. Um, but yeah, so I think <laughs> I had a baby either that or he's doing the bend. A real, a real dookie be, a big dookie be satisfying. Shit. So after pushing out a baby, that's gonna be like the most satisfying dookie mm-hmm. you've ever had in your life. I, but it's probably gonna be stinking, covered in booboo. Nuh-uh, you douche before a pregnancy. They make you douche? No, I'm just saying, you douche your booty. Oh, you douche your booty. I know somebody who got a colonics. My mom and my auntie get some, but I um have a friend who gets them. I don't know if I would. It's like they put a tube of water up your butt hole. Yeah, they clean it up. Suck and flush all the poop out your butt. It's a colon cleanse. That's kind of nasty though. That should make you feel so light. Do you not feel it going in your? My mom said she like she had one, and she said her stomach literally like. Wait, don't they inject coffee up there or something? Coffee. Edema. 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 Enema. 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 It's just a, a solution. It's not something specific. It's like saline. I also have oh, admixture cramps. Okay, so that gives me You guys talking about this because now in between my bed sheets is itching. Uh, baby, that's because you don't. You have no shower. <laughs> you have no shower. Now, now you're telling my business. Talking about some some people be washing their you know what with the hand soap in the bathroom. What? What? <laughs> you know? I don't know. <laughs> it said uh, well I have bad menstrual cramps too so maybe I could do a natural what I want to no you know when you start talking about your back itching and then your back start itching it's like when yes. we started talking about booties my booty is now like it's really itching in there just I'm scratch it with a comb like, <laughs> like come on they said, scratch it with a comb is sick it's listen, like, where's state board they said they, they said <laughs> Nasty. They said bad menstrual cramps is equivalent to being one centimeter dilated. Um, Only one? Mm-hmm. Yeah, girl. Um, I don't, I don't know. There, it's one, contra- about, right? one centimeter of contractions. If that's the case, I'm not going to make it. But you know what's crazy? I'd be sick as fuck. No, you're going to make it. Ever since I found that out when I'm on my period, well, I don't have one anymore, but when I be on my period and I be cramping, I start getting nauseous because I realize my cervix is opening and closed. Mm-hmm. And it makes me sick. And I'm like, ugh. You dilated. Uh-uh. Yeah, Let me be a labor and delivery nurse. No, I'm going to be the best encouraging not. person. Absolutely not. Yeah, Damn, Brie, I'm going to be a nurse by the time uh, you have your... Oh, I will? I could be, but I can't. I'm not going to be in labor and delivery. Baby, but... you weren't... I don't give a damn. What you <laughs> like, She was like, in there like this. Wow, that baby's got a lot of hair. Is that you? <laughs> yep, she about four four centimeter dilate. Let's get that little nigga out. <laughs> Your tiny little fingers. Yeah, and then after you had a baby, don't the doctor like shove all the way up to the elbow inside to pull out the placenta? What? what? The absolute. Okay, fun. look, no, y'all. I was at TikTok University. I don't know for sure. But. Usually, it falls out. I agree. Laboring at home is the trick. Laying in that bed will take you out. No, no, no. Because no. the way I be acting, I need, I need the doctor there immediately with the, a defibrillator. The reason they the design labor in the bed is very sick and was for the pleasure of a man. Yeah. Chainsaws were made for child delivery, but the best way to have a baby is on fours or standing up or sitting on the toilet. But what if you pushed and your baby hit hit their head in the toilet? You gotta be down there to catch it. <laughs> I'm not gonna let my baby hit their head in the nasty toilet water. They're gonna have rashes for weeks. Not rashes. You don't be in your toilet? Okay, but no, it's just the fact that the baby in the toilet. Mm-hmm. A little speck of boo boo. A little feces spe- could still be in there. You know, people. Po- look, if you pushing out your baby on the toilet, some people poop when they labor. And then you I'm look down, down when your baby fall on the toilet and their head is all brown because you boo boo didn't even know. No. Now you gotta give your baby emergency bath. Not emergency bath. <laughs> emergency bath is crazy. <laughs> like, no. 
You know how much stuff is on the baby when they come out? A little boo boo ain't gonna hurt. No. I can't wait. I have boo boo in his lungs. <laughs> wait, for real? Yeah, no. he boo booed in there and swallowed it. Damn. That's, That's what happened to my cousin, so too. That's why I was saying that babies are That's why he farts so much. Mm. Oh, yeah, they press on your stomach for the placenta down. It was wiggling, huh? <coughs> mm. Sorry. And then I want to meet them people that when I have a baby, soon as the baby come out, my stomach deflate like a balloon. Stomach be flat with a little bit of saggy skin. No. I don't know. That's not, not going to happen. happen. How long did it take for your stomach to go down? Mm. I'll say a couple weeks. Couple weeks, bitch. Yeah. Why though is it still holding its shape? It's just air now. It's no baby. That's I don't know. It, the worst part is when they press on your stomach. I believe it. Why are you pressing on my? Do stomach? they do that to you, bro? No, I have a C-section. Oh yeah, they. Oh, they only do that if you natural. I don't. I, don't I mean, like that. That. they still like touched on it though, but they wasn't doing nothing that hurt. My mom almost died when I was born. I was 10 pounds, y'all. What the fuck? I've been that? a plus size queen. <laughs> <laughs> 10 pounds? Wait, why was there a meme going around on Instagram? And it was like, damn, I, I really used to be 7 pounds, 11 ounces. I really let myself go. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Let me go back to 10. If we all went back to the world. Baby, you yeah. coming out your... Yeah. Well, you was a you was Yeah, I was a cereal. She couldn't push me. My sister that she was trying to push was nine pounds. My mom was skinny when she first had my sister. She went to the hospital July 6th. My sister had an emergency cesarean attempt because she started trying to hang herself. And my mom's pelvis was too small to fit my Wait, big what? old sister. <laughs> Wait, who was trying to hang themselves? My sister umbilical cord was like wrapped tight around her neck. <laughs> Tight around her neck, so for real. I was like, wait. But I feel her, what? you know, who don't want to end it all before they even get here. Now we got to work and stuff. Bitch. I'm <laughs> so fucking done. She could have so just went right back with her Lord and Savior. Not with her So, you know, Lord yeah, Savior. my mom's pelvis was too small. She was in labor for four days. Ugh. What? And I guess my sister was just preparing her for me. You know, my sister was nine pounds. I was ten pounds. Then my brother came. He was eight pounds. He was a small. What's brother. wrong with y'all? Why was y'all so big? My mama was seven pounds. My daddy was nine. And that's the one that tore my granny all the way to that little booty hole. So. <laughs> little booty hole is sick. Well, I'm sure my granny was a little baby. She's still little, and she don't have a neck or her head little, her body little. I know she's a little baby. <laughs> you my just granny. eating the family up. God damn. You want a boot camp? No, I thought I graduated. I don't need boot camp. No, you ain't saved or delivered. Your tongue is... is No. Whoopsies. You still need whippings. Baby whippings. That girl said her while her sister tried to hang herself in the womb. I, I first I thought she meant her mom was suicidal. I'm like, oh shit! I'm like, oh no! I was like, what? But yeah, like I don't know, a baby not being able to fit out your pelvis. How does the doctors not know that and keep trying to make you have a baby? That's like really dangerous. Yeah, some mm -hmm. people' pelvis is just literally too small. That's crazy though, like. I thought we was all technically built the same down here. Mm -hmm. And my brother kept trying to make fun of me for being overweight. So I told him that a woman's uterus is 12 pounds. He Googled it and it's actually only two pounds. So. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had a leg to stand on and he chopped it down. I'm weak. That's hella fucking funny. You thought you ate, huh? But some people uterus fall out. Y'all can also Google that. Why do you know these fucking random ass birthdays? Because I wanted to be a labor and delivery nurse, and then I said, oh, when Gianna was born, it was so traumatizing. So instead, I'm going to be a psychologist. Wait, so Amani, in nursing school, do you guys have to watch your birth? Yes, that's next semester. I'm so fucking Ooh, excited. Oh, I'll be excited, too. Like, you watch an actual one, or, like, in person? No, we watch a video. Oh. But certain schools, you can watch an actual one. It's just, they, they having trouble finding those clinical sites for labor and delivery. Y'all can watch mine. Bitch, no. You have like the. We'll be out of school by then, huh? Oh. I'm gonna write the school and say I would like to volunteer. That's sick as fuck. You gonna have a whole class standing in here? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna be like, who are these people? I'm sure. <laughs> Man, we'll be graduated by October. We'll be graduated in July. So, we're not gonna wait till you fucking decide to pop your baby. So, you mind you're gonna be a labor and delivery nurse? That's what I wanna do. Uh, wait. Wow. I really want to be a, a, a nurse midwife. Like, I really want to deliver babies. Ooh, I have a question. Have you been in school for four years? No, I've been in school for uh, six months. Oh, okay. I have a question. Mm -hmm. If you could, if you were pregnant mm -hmm. and they had a program for seven months. Where, where basically you allow students to do your delivery beginning to end with no teacher present, 
like basically what happens is the semester that the, the students do the child birth labor and delivery mm -hmm. it's a project four students get together and they'll deliver your baby start to finish with no doctor present only way a doctor will come in is if it's an emergency and like you're right about to like you're about to die and they have to <laughs> administer you something immediately but would you donate would you like allow students to do your no. pregnancy for listen i didn't finish my wedding would you allow the students to do your pregnancy for a project if you were guaranteed fifty thousand dollars fifty can't enough give me fifty million we got something to talk about <laughs> fifty million <laughs> Five million. Five hundred thousand. Cause like students, you get you get fifty okay, listen, you get fifty thousand dollars and then when your kid turns eighteen you get one million dollars. I get it or they get it. You you get it. One million dollars. One million. I would say no one million once they turn five because it's no one million once they turn one because you got they gotta make sure everything was delivered, no birth defects, nothing. And you get fifty thousand as soon as the baby pops out. Fifty thousand instantly deposited. I'm gonna have to pass on that now. I don't wanna risk my life for a million and fifty thousand dollars. Let me risk And you my can't life do life. you can't do no epidural. You just have to let the students oh, no. actually you can let the students administer the epidural if you want to, but everything is gonna be their first time. First it's of, a project to see how well they learn. Baby, first of all I don't wanna be nurses yes. can't even administer epidurals. That's the anesthesiologist. We're this is my fucking scenario. <laughs> her, her Please tell me I heard about the young lady who delivered her baby and doctors amputated her baby's head. I didn't hear about yeah, that. Yeah, they got charged oh, God, that's for sick. it. What happened with that, though? They was pulling, her, pulling the baby out and they pulled it to her and they pulled the baby head off. What? what? I would literally die. Like, what? Wait, really? Yeah. I had seen that because it was a black couple, right? Yeah, yeah. of course. <laughs> how do you pull a baby's head off? Like, how hard was they Are pulling? you yanking my baby? That make me want to get up and attack you right now. That's hella no. So to answer your question, fuck no. And plus I'm high risk. I if the doctor you. said you were the baby had to go, who y'all picking? The that baby. baby. What the hell? Bye bye. Baby. I ain't ready to go see the king. I need to fix some stuff. <laughs> to the little little nigga. <laughs> I can always have another one. Right. I yell shit. Not you, not you in my stomach though, but. You can only save two. Your child drowning. Now, if it's a baby or Dre, I'm saying million dollars. Because I know that's what Dre will want. <laughs> Not that's what Dre will want. You know what I hate? I hate when people say shit like, like if you was talking to Dre, like, who would you say, Brie or Kai? I would say Brie because I know that's what she would want. You don't know what the fuck I want. Say, right. Shit, say Kai, maybe, right. You ain't finna remember? Adios. Else is crazy. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, I love Kai. If it was Kai, I would choose me. But if it's a baby that like you Amy just got born, born no, I don't even know if I really like you or fuck with you like that. Yeah, I gotta feel your vibe first. I like, gotta feel your vibe. It's crazy. <laughs> I just met you. Shit. I'm big on vibes. The baby's exactly. vibe not good. They gotta go. Adoption center. I don't know what the hell. Try okay, again. Wait. Wow. So you don't even let the phlebotomy students take your blood? I don't either. I do. For the record, no. They said they cut the baby's head off, not pulled it off. Oh, oh I thought it was cut. How, how did you chop it? Why do you have something to chop the baby's head off? I thought they pulled it too hard in the baby's head. Like, I mean, obviously not like this fell off. Yeah, like dislocated. Ouch, that's good. Yeah, they can't cut the baby's head off. You don't even got no scissors big enough for that. Cut the baby. Why would they have a machete? Meat cleaver. Oh, yeah, I, think I, I thought they pulled it. was pulling it. They like, you know. Somebody what? tell us the story. Because that don't even sound right. Chop the baby head off. What the fuck? Oh, unless they were doing a C-section and maybe the way they cut. They cut that deep. No, I think it might have but... been the baby was too big because they pushed the head back in and found out through C-section. Oh. Cool, not cut. It was cool, not cut. They tried to cover it. It was cool. What that mean? Right. Y'all need to get the story straight. Or Y'all need to get y'all type of The baby right? got stuck in the birth canal and they pulled too hard and popped the head off. Oh, yeah. my God. What? what? Yeah, I know they pulled it. Chopping is crazy. Wait, so I wonder, like, in cases where, because would that not be a freak accident? Because, I mean, if the baby is stuck, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, is that not a freak accident? Or, <clears throat> no. But for them to get charged, it had to be some type of neglect. So that's was why. Was it the doctor or was it nurses? They pull, uh, People keep saying they pulled it too hard. I think you was right. Yeah, because cutting don't make no damn sense. I would say cutting would make sense if it was like a C-section, but even then, like you're not cutting. No, but yeah, once you start cutting back, like you know, you start cutting layers and you pull like the or the specific organs out that are in the uh, way. You see the head, and all you do is pull. You ain't cutting to where you like. You know what I'm saying? Like you see the top of the head. Yeah. 
And then you pull the baby out. They were not supposed to pull the baby. They yes, but they tried to hide the fact that the baby was decapitated. What? Oh. That's they trying to hide it too, that's bad. Decapitating a baby is fucking insane. Oh my god. People been having babies since people been on this earth and they ain't found a safe she way to do She used forceps. What? That's crazy. Yeah, you don't pull a baby out the mom pushes. But when you doing a C-section... But if they know, stuck, I mean... Y'all, catch me in third semester. I got two more weeks until I get to third semester. Now, I'll let y'all know what the fuck really happened down there because this not making no sense. I can't confirm or deny this yet. Yeah, this making my stomach hurt. So, next topic. <sighs> Uh-uh. <laughs> you gotta cut that shit off. Uh, Sorry, y'all. Excuse me. Uh -huh. No, come right on. Right back at you. <laughs> back at you. I guess what's in the air. That's crazy. Nape? Mm. Nape roots. Ever since I got my hair cut, though, because my hair was like all thin and stuff at the end, It'd be so hard to blow dry and it'd be feeling so nappy still. Really? Yes. Like, oh my God. I feel like you look thicker I'll now getting, that like, yes. you cut all that off. I'll be in the arm workout. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, yeah, mom, I'm not doing it no more. You don't do it. He said, no, I'm not. She couldn't push it on that she did a stop and rest to the C-section. Sounds good. Wait, so y'all didn't answer the question. None of y'all will have students deliver your kid. You get no, one million, no, one million no, when he turns one. No, that's not enough. And fifty thousand. My pregnancy gonna be high risk, so no. I might, I might do it. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> not you might do it. Shit, what's the chances? I mean, you ain't gonna die because the doctor gonna rush in. When you said when you almost about to die, what if the doctor is too late? No, die that's not me. the way the scenario works. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> die for a million. $50,000. That's crazy. It'd be feeling so satisfying getting my hair braided. I just love people's hands in my hair. Hmm. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Let me not say that. No, it's not bad. But like when people smile, I, like, I love your teeth. Um, Would y'all, um, okay, what if, uh, the Lord came down back to earth. You know how he gonna come back and take all his people back. Yeah. What if he came back and he said, "I got a, I got a special, uh, I got a special uh, gift that I want to give some of my children." Mm -hmm. And what if he was like, "You can tell me how many kids you want right now, and I'll basically give you a pregnancy, symptom free. You just get the belly, so you can still do your gender reveal and all that. You'll not, you won't be nauseated. You'll have no pregnancy symptoms. You won't feel anything during the delivery. You don't even need an epidural. Okay. It'll just, baby, will just flow right out. Mm -hmm. But you gotta cut off both of your thumb toes what? and your one of your thumbs and your one of your pinkies. No, Lord. you don't got. I, you're not gonna <laughs> feel it. You're not gonna feel it when I cut it off. But you're not gonna have it. It's just gonna be nubs. No. So a nub here, no. a nub here, and then no thumb toes. No. Your toes, you need all of them because that's how you balance. And then all these nubs and missing fingers. What if your baby choke? You can't even stick your finger down their throat to <laughs> save them. So I'm gonna have Keep to my You're only missing two fingers. You look like this. That's enough for me. no, no, Lord. I don't want no nubs. <laughs> no, no, Lord. No. <laughs> no what? I gotta give away fingers and toes to have a smooth delivery is crazy. Okay, what if he just said, what if he just said, I'll give you, I'll give you a baby and a pregnancy, symptom free. Not it's okay, Lord. <laughs> I'll give you a baby, symptom free. No pregnancy symptoms. You won't feel the delivery. You don't need an epidural, nothing. You uh, just get to enjoy the pregnancy. Okay. But I gotta take your hairline. Your hairline is gonna be pushed back to wherever your ear starts. So what? From, so from <laughs> here to here, you gonna be bald. Oh no! no. Yeah, I, I, guys, that's a perfect foundation for a wig install. No. Are you kidding me? You need to get the hairline transplanted. Give it, like black to, give it to me, Lord. Give it to me, Lord. No, you want to be bald like an old black man? <laughs> no. And, and all, and you just gonna have taco meat from here to here. So you taco can make, meat? You can no. Make it just, you can make it edges. You want to have a baby so bad? Cause no, yeah. That's yeah. <laughs> All of these circumstances, I'm not willing to do. Never in a million years. What? For a symptom-free pregnancy? Imagine your hairline starting at your ears. Your forehead can fit like 10 fingers. 
Now, why you get on my forehead? I don't know. Mine's is too. A week. That's a perfect week foundation. <clears throat> they said pregnancy is 10 months, not a lifetime. <laughs> Yeah, but it's symptom free, no <laughs> pain. My hair yeah, line like this for the last time. I got nubs for a lifetime. That's no everything pain. about that pregnancy. You need to make someone like easy, like, oh, you don't got no nails on your toes. Just told me. Who is calling? Told me it's crazy. <laughs> I know. That's Someone calling me? Sick. The group chat. Who is the 909? Monique. Oh, I'll never say her number. Who is she calling for? Answer it. Mm-mm. Why are they trying to stick a Q-tip in this dog booty hole? Not Taco Bean, that just scared me. I'm weak. People really got Taco Bean edges? Yes. <laughs> That's sick. That's sick. Baby, you dealt with one. Are you fucked? Why does Bray get them boneless? <laughs> it is. Look at it. I'm adding hair to it, but I think that, uh, that hairline is coming. Oh, no. It's coming. True, Kimaya. Let me stop speaking. But I, I didn't take the ingredients. The Lord is doing instant deliveries right now, like DoorDash. Oh, now he, he pulled up with that shit early. Yeah. Real early. God, Lord, you just heard that prayer. Let me stop playing with you, Jesus, because I need you to do your big one on this pregnancy, so let me shut up. Before we have do time, your we big one. Precious Lord. Precious love. Like women have taco meat on their chest. Me too. And I hate when they armpit hair that's long enough that they stick out the armpit. That shit is That's nasty. nasty. You got deodorant clamps all in your shit. Or when you can see they toe knuckle hair all the way from like standing all the way over there. What? <laughs> First of all, I don't even want to see a man's toes because that's a term. My ex, his toe knuckles were like so hairy and scary. I don't want to see your toes and I don't want to see your butt crack. Those are two things that no. But does Dre have like pretty feet for it? No. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> No, they sit on top of each other. They bend. Oh, his toes? Oh, wow. Typical man. He could probably hold a beer bottle. <laughs> That's nasty. His toes are long. It's just no. Yeah, I'm not a fan. So I can crack his other toe well, with his good. toe. He could what? He could put one of his toes in a chokehold and crack it. <laughs> <laughs> like, he can grab it with two toes. That is so nasty, and actually. Crack it, and crack it. And, and one of them just sit on top of each other. I don't think something about cute. flexible toes. I just don't like. Yeah, why are your toes flexible? Dre's toes could ball a fist. That's an issue for me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. Uh, that's I don't nasty. like that. They bend like fingers. I don't like that. My toes don't do that, but I got like, I have like short, fat extremities. Mm, that's sick. If I had a man, if I was a man. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> you catch my dress. Because everything is like short, fat, and stubby. <laughs> Well, I don't know if that's a good thing to be a man. Yeah. Coming from a person that had morning sickness for seven months at heartburn, the whole time, hell no, I wish I could have a hairline. So, Miss Nat, you rather be sick? So, being pregnant, like your first time okay, is like being on your period all the time, like as far as the sickness? It's not period sickness, it's nausea. Mm-hmm. It's like nausea. Imagine just feeling like you have to throw up constantly, but you don't always have to throw up. You know, mouthy watering and stuff too. It's not watering. It's just that feeling in your stomach. Like I hate that feeling. And then when I never throw up, like I don't want to throw up, but at the same time, like I do because I want to just get it over with. Yeah, yeah. I hate being nauseous. That shit pisses me off so bad. Yeah. See that, and I just hate being sick, like in general, not like cold sickness, but I'm talking about like stomach hurt. Yeah, it's like period mm-hmm. symptom sick. That shit pisses me off. And on my period, like, I feel like I can't even leave the toilet because, like, the diarrhea is extreme. Period shits is something that needs to be talked about and stuff. No, but that be yeah. feeling good. It's come out so fast. Nah, that like, should be having my stomach so... No, that be great. Ter- it be tearing like my that. stomach up. No, I like Until that. it come out. I like that. Because when it comes out and it's, like, the soft, slushy guy. Yes, it's always soft, like a yes, chocolate like melted that. ice cream. Ew. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't even like chocolate ice cream, though. Really? I love chocolate yeah. ice cream. With a brownie and fudge. I want it all chocolate. No, damn, mm. she pregnant? What the fuck? Who's pregnant? Like, everybody is pregnant right now. Is this the baby, the new baby boomer era? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's in the food. It makes you guys more fertile. Okay, so would y'all rather, would y'all rather have your period every day Ugh. for a year? Or would you ha- rather have the flu for three months? 
Oh, that's terrible. No, you might even think about it. You can't breathe out your nose for what, like nights in a row. Yes. For three weeks? For three, three months. The flu for three months or your period every day for okay, a year? Okay, but I have all my period symptoms every day or just some symptoms one day, another symptom another day? You know, you might not necessarily have the symptoms every day, but definitely a heavy heavy bleeding every day. No, bitch. Give me sick. I'll I get sick. Heavy bleeding every I'm day so and occasional cramping. Oh my god, I was the optional to die. Um, I think I'm gonna have to go with the for a year though. Okay, I'm gonna have to go with the flu because if the period was for three months, then maybe we could discuss the period option, but that's not even an option anymore. Like heavy flow every day, you can't you never wear what you want because you always have to wear like big pampers. I don't know. What would y'all do? A flu bleeding for a whole year would be draining as fuck. No, for real. I ain't gonna lie. I don't. I can't do the flu though. I ain't gonna lie. I can't do the <laughs> really? flu. Really? So you gonna bleed heavy flow for a whole year? Always feeling like disgusting. I'm gonna say either, either, but can't nobody else choose me either. Only me because I created. It. <laughs> oh, oh boo. <laughs> nah, I, if I really have to choose, I might say the flu for three months. Just yeah. get it over with. I just get it over with. Three months. Three months is better than 12. Shoot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I almost died from having a heavy flow and bleeding for two weeks straight. Damn, really? Is it just you losing too much blood, Nikki, or what? How does that work? I wonder, does she have low iron? Period makes me feel uncomfortable when sleeping. I just hate it. I don't, I hate it. And the pad be wrestling and stuff. Oh. No, but the way this scenario works, you're not going to pass out. And you're not going to die. Go <laughs> Y'all be too realistic. It's a scenario. <laughs> Shit. It's like, but I didn't, I'll be the passed out. No. In this scenario, there's no passing out. There's none. But if you get the flu, it could escalate to pneumonia. Mm-mm. Damn. Uh-uh, uh-uh no. I t- I'm ready to pick the period one because now we're going to go to pneumonia. Can it escalate from pneumonia? No. Okay. Uh-uh, but... Pneumonia was so draining. I almost died with pneumonia when I was like seven. Did you? Yeah. And then the medicine they gave me for it, amoxicillin, well, penicillin, I'm allergic to it. And I had rash bumps all over my body, like red and itchy. Uh Yeah, so even the medicine didn't help me. It just made me now sick and itchy. I don't know what they did after that. I'm not doing that. Yeah, that was very terrible. (sighs) Okay. Would you rather have a smell like a stench on you? Like no. let's say you smell like <laughs> let's smell like let's say you smell like doo-doo. No cologne will take it away, no nothing. It's a combination of doo-doo and must. Mm-hmm. Would you rather stink for a year or would you ha- rather have a baby four years in a row? Like I'm pregnant back to back to pregnant back, back to back to back four years in a row. And how long does the doo-doo smell last? A year. I'm stinking like fuck. I ain't having no baby. Yeah, I can't get pregnant back to back to back. My four years in a row. No. Yeah, no. One pregnancy is too much. So, um, no. You rather stink for a year? So, what you gonna go out in public? If my man really loves me, he gonna be down for me in my situation. (laughs) So you gonna stay at home or you going out in public? I'm gonna go out in. I'm gonna go out in the bubble and pretend like I have anxiety issues. So only I can smell me, eat through my little bubble and all that. No, it can't be no bubble. You gotta let the world smell it. That's I'm not going out scenario. Like, outside at a park in a different country where nobody will remember me. The babies for sure. Babies four years in a row. I'll be in the house, work from home, job, you know, for real. Now I damn near did that already. I'm weak. <laughs> so y'all would do it again? I'm gonna have to stink because I can't do no four kids. Yeah, four I'm back, sorry. And then it's back to back. Like your life and back to back pregnancy is like, damn, I just wanna know. No. Because I hate the, the bad sleep during pregnancy, so, no. Yeah, and then I like to sleep on my stomach, and you can't sleep on your stomach. And my back. You can't sleep on your back? No, not after a certain amount of months. I'll still be sleeping on my back sometimes, but you're not supposed to. That's crazy. Sleeping on your back pregnant is crazy. Yeah, I feel like the baby will be too heavy and stuff on you. You know, sleeping, sleeping on your well, stomach. I think it's harder than to breathe or something like that, I don't know. Mm-mm. Is the baby even breathing if it's in water? 
The baby's just sitting there like a fish. <laughs> the baby's not breathing. I'm weak. So we'll be a funky crowd. Yes. Don't book no appointment in four years in a row. Because you ain't coming to me. <laughs> they gonna leave out. Oh, I'd rather just... What you mean, who? Or my natural. That I just want to live. I study. I'm weak. It is like... What's crazy is like before I got pregnant, I wasn't even thinking about laying on my back or laying on my stomach. Now that I'm pregnant, it's like I hella want to do it. Yeah. But it's like I usually just sleep on my side. If I wait until somebody don't do something, I don't want to do it. Yes. Do not go in there. Okay, let me just see. Right. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. We breathe for the baby. <sighs> Shit. So mammals, wait, oh, I'm going to say something stupid because mammals live in the water too, so. But whales have to come up for air. Can I get some hair in my niche? Whales yeah. always have to come up for air. So if every yes, mammal well. requires air, why does baby not require air for how long do they have a nose? Maybe the last four months of the pregnancy. But even whales because require Because they're air. submerged in water. Babies are fake mammals. That fake mammals. Fake mammals. Fake mammals. Impossible. Are you sitting on my phone? No, it's right here. Nothing is wrong with my booty. I watched it two days ago, so don't do that. Two. <laughs> so, B. Simone said you could go three days. B. Simone. I'm sure Simone. she's went three days. What's the longest y'all ever went without showering? I don't know. Y'all may admit that on days. YouTube. Probably so, three, four days. Mm -hmm. I went three days. When I had pneumonia and I was at home with my dad. If I was with my mom, y'all know that wouldn't have happened. She would have got me in that tub. My dad didn't even know this. I had him in the same pajamas for three days. <laughs> like, wow. My sister had the flu, then she had pneumonia back to back. She lost like 16 pounds. I ain't gonna lie. If I could lose 55 pounds from having the flu and pneumonia, I would do it. Bro, when everybody got, like, okay, so when I got COVID, because my friend got COVID, and she mm -hmm. was like, I lost so much weight, I lost 20 pounds. Because she couldn't eat, she didn't have no appetite. When I got COVID, I gained four pounds. I was oh, hella no. mad. Because when I got COVID, I was hella scared because obviously it was like the pandemic and I was like nervous, like, oh shit, I got it. Like, you don't know how it's going to escalate. Mm -hmm. But I was like, well, I guess at least I'll lose some weight. No, bitch. Yeah, I didn't lose it. shit. <laughs> I'm like, what? And multiple t people told me that they lost weight on COVID. So what did I do wrong? Not on COVID. Like, it's a drug. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do wrong? I don't know. When I had the stomach, I got, uh, What's it called? Food poisoning? And I was shitting and throwing up at the same time. Girl, I lost so much weight. I was sick as a dog for two days. But bitch, that shit was worth it because my double dream was gone. What'd you get? What you mean? I don't know what it was. I, I felt like I ate something that night and me and Spice was there. And he like, I was like, no, I'm like, we were, we was watching my show. And I was like, nah, I'm finna throw up. Like, I gotta, you know, you can go home. And so I just remember laying on the couch and he kissed me on my forehead and he left. And so I need a kiss from him or something. Sure, I don't know. Maybe that's the shit that got me sick. Cause I went straight to that fucking toilet and threw us. Where I fucked up was. This I bent, No, <laughs> I I sat. I bent over to throw up. Bitch, I shit it all up the wall. No, oh, you didn't. Oh, you yes. you you projectile shit it. Yes, it was that watery, bitch. That's Double hella dragon. nasty. I was hella mad. Double dragon. What the <laughs> hell? It got in the toilet. It was all up the wall. All up on the <laughs> curtain. I mean the uh, shower uh, thing. <laughs> I texted him, I was like, I shit it everywhere. He keep FaceTime me cracking up. He said, let me see. Uh, I said, let me see. I said, he was like, oh my God. He started cracking up. He said, well, let me know if you need anything. Click. That's why you single, bitch. That shit probably replays in his head. <laughs> Girl, you been worse up the wall. He started thinking about through sickness and through health and knew he couldn't be with your shitty booty stuff. <laughs> he not changing Girl. that diaper. I was in there with hella fucking uh, cleaning products trying to clean, but I was so sick to my stomach. I was like this. <laughs> Cause I cannot leave that shit there, but no, I had no real. energy. You can't. You can't. Every but you gotta love when you can. My mama clean up my boo boo. Yeah, my mom end up going in. But think about it. it. That's cause y'all mama already cleaned up y'all boo boo. I mean, it's the same boo boo. That's that first one though. No. Just worse. Grown same. people boo boo <laughs> and baby boo boo. No, that shit was sick as fuck. I hate cleaning up Kai's boo boo. Though. I, I did that. Lie. I did shit up the wall, but I, I mean, the next time, but I shit it and threw up every two hours that night. Oh, I had a sickness like that too when I went to Reno. I don't know what was going on with me. And then it got to the point where I was in the bed with a guard drag on because I kept getting up. And then it was a point where I would just like be gagging and nothing would come out. Only boo boo. I pooped on myself like two times and my mom had to throw my pants in the shower and, yeah, that and jump be in. Those sicknesses be 
be really Oh my god, my whole family had the sickness. My dad had it when we went to Reno for his birthday. And then his stomach sickness went away. We enjoyed the rest of Reno. We got home, we watched the Super Bowl, we had some barbecue, and then me and my brother woke up at the same time at night. Mm -hmm. I got one more Just gagging. Throwing up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it does look like some like a landing strip. Would you ever, if the bill at the restaurant is too high, would you ever, like that movie Kevin Hart on it, grab some of your pubes hair and put it in the food, see if you get money off? What? What? First of all, I, no. <laughs> or grab some of your pubes. How you gonna grab some of your pubes hair? You would have to have scissors and cut it. That's hella nasty. Or you can yank it out like a soldier. No. <laughs> Would you ever die in a dash? Of course. I mean, it's on my bucket list. What? Yes, yeah, I want to do it in the state like Nebraska. Baby, you gonna get shot. <laughs> oh, I need to do it. No, I wouldn't do nothing like that. State. But how would they know if you died in a dash? I can't. I'm too scary. I'm, I'm no. Think like really First of all, no. I don't like to run, so that's number one. <laughs> <laughs> Me neither. Number two. No, I'm just hella scared. You call your Uber, your Uber outside. As soon as you realize your Uber outside. No, because oh, sometimes you get in the Uber and they look back at you. Brianna? No, bitch, drive. Like, okay, actually, don't get in the Uber. You got to bring your own No, car. then they be tapping on the screen trying to get the directions. All right, we're no. going to Walmart and back it up. Because it's going to be a rental Okay, room. let's go. So you need to actually have your own rental car because the plan is you got your bags packed. Everything is in your rental car. You finna fly back home. You dine and dash right before your flight. Fly to the airport, turn in that car, and get on the plane. The news is going to be the spread by the time you're on the plane. They ain't going to do no emergency. The news is crazy. That shit is not going to the news. Exactly. <laughs> just evacuate the state. Just go fucking chicken dinner <laughs> be a pie buffet. Leave the state within the next two hours, and you good. That's you act like you just robbed a, a bank. So you wouldn't leave the Zoom state. Zoom to the airport. I'm you get on that. Because you said you're scared. I'm Let's not. Just leave the state. I'm not. How about you do the right thing, and you pay for the food that you purchased in the valley? That's no fun. That's no fun, that's <laughs> You didn't realize definition of a yellow, huh? <laughs> yes, you only live once. I got a few things on my bucket list. What else is on there? I'm just curious. Um, I really want to try to drive a car blindfolded in a parking lot. What? <laughs> but no, no. This is the thing. The person can't hear. They got in full blast beats on, but they can see an A in a passenger seat. And I can't see, but I can hear. And I'm driving the car in a parking lot like a lot of expensive cars. Just to see if I accidentally graze somebody. I think that's good partnership skills. You should try to do it with your spouse. That's Baby, sick. I'm not letting <laughs> nobody get behind no wheel and no car blindfolded with me in it, please. <laughs> no, you just tell them, stop. And they can hear, they just can't see. They stop. Well, that's a good thing. I, my brother would you try that too much. Uh, you watch too much marriage boot camp. <laughs> my sister, you know, every year they got a segment where they do the something couple like bondings. Yeah. I love them so much. I hate on the hip hop ones where they reenact the music video and then they switch partners and you got to twerk on somebody else's partner. Oh, friend, that was only one. So that's one. <laughs> that's I thought we one time. <laughs> yeah. I was like, that was like that was hella specific. So I remember that one. I watched that. They always do something like that though. Do they? Where you gotta I do like something I with? On that one season. Where you gotta do something with other people's partners? Yeah. Like they be switching you? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause they like to see who's jealous. But I see. I feel like that was the late, the last one, right? Cause I didn't watch them. I don't know. Has there been a new one recently? I don't think so. If there has, after the one with uh, Kim Michelle. America. Yeah. With Kim Michelle. I feel like a lot of those shows kind of dying out now. Yeah. They can still issue a warrant for you. And the next time you go to that state, they'll treat you. Who the hell going back to Nebraska? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I just came there to dine and dash and get oh, I said away. they'll treat you. I meant arrest you, huh? I just came to Nebraska to dine and dash and leave. I'm not well, going to Nebraska. Why would you Nebraska? Because they seem like they got open carry. states. I want to go to Nebraska, Wyoming, Utah. Like, so what you going to do when they shoot your kneecap off? I'm going to get a prosthetic. And I'm going to the court. Don't, don't shoot me for stealing food. I could have been poor or anything. I'm going to show up with holy clothes, too, so I didn't think I'm poor. <laughs> Hair not dead. What you going to do when they say, Judge, we would like to uh, we would like to present Exhibit A, and they play this video where you say, how you going to show up? I'm going to say, that's before I lost all my money. <laughs> I mean, I got to eat. That's not what I mean. Cause you can't raise a man. I wonder why she fell off. Raise she was like popular a little and then she just disappeared. Okay, I have another one. Okay. Uh, 
Would you rather make out with a bum once a week? No. <laughs> Wait, yeah. once a week for three months straight, would you rather make out with a bum? Or would you rather eat jail food for one year straight? That's all you can eat is jail food. Make out with the bum? Once no. a week. Just You only got to make out one for five seconds. Five. No. Four. Wait, so it has three, to be tongue or can it just be a lot of lips? One. <laughs> like, it can honestly be whatever you want, but if the bum is feeling frisky, they get to do, no, do whatever they want. No, they're not in my mouth. I'm putting bleach in it. You're putting bleach in your mouth? Would okay. you rather make out with a bum for one one week? I'm going to make out with a bum because you know why? I'm going to say, here, babe, I brought, I brought you toothbrush. Brush them teeth for like 30 minutes and then we can make out. No, they be having tartar to build up like. Oh, well, you right, you right, you right. But the jail food, I'm very picky. I don't, I don't look like I, I don't eat that. Stuff. Actually, I might do the jail food because I might lose some weight. I can make spread and Baby, a honey bun The only cake. thing that's the right answer is eat the jail food. <laughs> <laughs> I can't kiss no. I'm not eating a regular jail. Everybody food, said jail food. Eat spread and a honey bun cake. That's your best bet. Technically, don't isn't jail food technically noodles? Yeah, but they, That's it. they have to buy that. Bitch, I'm going to be throwing up by the end of eating all that. I'm going to just... I'll take for a year. I'm never I choose eating. death. <laughs> I was going to say, can I Death die? is not an option in this scenario. I'm sorry, so... Why are you so strict? You remind me of Jigsaw. <laughs> <laughs> Cut off your leg. No, because I can't when people say death or like both. What? No, Cut off my leg. Both is crazy in this scenario. Wait, who would say both? <laughs> Unless they're actually, like, stupid. No, for real. Both. Jail food and a bug. <laughs> I like a little bit of flavor. Mm. Like, no. That's been on my bucket list. <laughs> I've been waiting to kiss you. <laughs> Come nice. here, give me all that time. Y'all think bums do it with other bums? Yes. Of course. My yeah. I, I was with my dad bum and I yes. a bum playing with himself under a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> he was very excited. And he interrupted? No, me and my dad were just at the freeway and he was like, oh, turn around. Because first it was out. And I was like, six. And he covered up, you know, put us up under the blanket and got back to work. Mm -hmm. You got to do your big one. No matter what stage of life you're in. I got you. Yeah, it's just my year. That's all. It's just the same. <laughs> my mom needs to burn. <laughs> Wait, a whole, a whole, it's just a whole a flat iron print on your ear. It's just the same. Who's thing. Brianna Jones? Bree, it's me. You're number one. I just got off the phone with Mark. Oh, that's my, uh, that's my brother's friend. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm in here in real life. I like her. Hey, well, hey. I was like, Brianna, no. <laughs> you friends with Mario? I feel so bad for you, sweetie. <laughs> Girl, that's her favorite person. Really? Mm -hmm. No, I don't know. Let him tell it. You know, he be delusional. He delusional as fuck. He always thinks somebody hella cool him. No, we're hella, we're hella fucking cool. <laughs> we're hella cool. She'll do anything for me. If I ask her to come right now, she'll be on her way. Shut up. Hella annoying. Like You're hella annoying and dusty. <laughs> dusty. <laughs> Not calling him dusty. <laughs> Not too much on my brother. Brother, brother. He's already grown with brother, brother. Can you shut the fuck up? I was singing. Is that how you talk to a pregnant woman? Wow, my daughter just heard you disrespect. Oh my god, <laughs> not how you talk to a pregnant woman. Disrespecting me in front of my own seed is crazy. Mm -hmm. Your seed can't hear, actually. <laughs> Your seed is just a seed. <laughs> Literally. It's just a noob. That's crazy how that make a baby, like, what? Why can't, like, I don't know, something else make a baby? That's how I'm not going to talk about my friend. Uh-uh, Brianna. Uh-uh. See, I told you. Ugh. She got to like him. I ain't saying like him, like him, but that's her friend. Mm -mm. You gonna stick beside your friend. Mm -mm. I'm glad he got somebody in his cone. <laughs> Not somebody. Because it ain't your friend. Girl, he's a Virgo. Hey, you ain't never talked to my brother. He is hella annoying. I don't even know how he got a friend. Is your younger, the younger, darker one, or the older, lighter one? Older. Um, what does their color have to do with anything, Kimaya? That's how I tell the difference. Brianna, what's your sign? Me. What's your sign, Brianna? And how do you get along with him? You must be a Virgo, too. Right. Or Pisces. No, she don't get a Virgo. Her vibes kind of gave, like, Sagittarius. Mm, that's not good at all. Yeah, them Sagittarius, oh, Sagittarius something is. else. Ooh. Not no issues, please. <laughs> I'm going to make a registry, y'all. But I'm kind of waiting to figure out the gender because, to be honest, like, this time around, like, since I, um, 
like since I already have Kai, I want to be real intentional with my registry because I don't want to just be putting random stuff on there. Like I want it to be stuff that I actually mm-hmm. am gonna need and use. And like I have a lot of boy stuff for Kai, so there's stuff that I wouldn't put if it were a boy. So I'm a I'm kind of oh, okay. Never mind. I'm a Scorpio. Oh baby, you the worst of the bunch. <laughs> she a Scorpio? Oh fuck. Oh snaps. Okay. People don't like Scorpios. I really only know one Scorpio. Oh. She got on her. Oh, girl, I know hella Scorpios. I know another Scorpio that I like. Who? Um, her name is Ayana. She worked for Heat. She's cool. Mm. She older though, but she just hella fun. Well, I guess three Scorpios, because I like Bree. She was fun too. We party. We played drinking games. It was a time. Where did y'all have this time? At the uh, duplex where I used to live. She came to my house. Oh. Mm-hmm. She flew out from Arizona to visit. Oh, that's nice. Mm-hmm. She was hella cool. She got lit. November 21st on the last day of Scorpio, but. Have sad according to the people. Oh, baby, I don't like Sagittarius either. I so. love Sagittarius. See, mm-hmm. that's why she was a vibe. You're probably hella cool, though. So I'm not even going to do that. I know one Scorpio that I like. So you might be the second one. No, she was cool. I'm telling you. You know, I'm be doing people. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, people be getting on my nerves. I know. Me too. I just hate having to interact with people. But otherwise, how would you build relationships? So I do. Mm-hmm. And then when and my teacher signs a group assignment, I'm like, can I work alone? And they say, no, that's the point of it being a group assignment. Why can't I do stuff how I want to do it? Because mm, when they do it how I don't like it, then I'm mad. I do be hating that. And I hate when, like, you're an aesthetic person and, like, let's say you got to yes. make a poster board and they be like, I want to glue this right here. Not my oh, project ugly. That don't belong there. Girl, that was me having to do a project. I had to just let it go. I hate that. Or I hate when you're making slides and you got a certain aesthetic and then they slide just got hella shit on it. Like... Yeah, that's like, no. I was like, just write down your information, I'll make them. Yeah, I'll make them. I'll do the extra work. Cause bitch, no. And I hate the overachiever who's like, we need a plan. No, we don't. A plan, baby. This is a class project. And then at the end, we come together and make it make sense. Right. That's why it feels like we're not working together. Because I don't really do want to work with you. How about that? She's already grown what you're going to do. I'm gonna do my singing. I'm gonna be a singer. Can you actually sing? No. Are you um, does not hear that? I thought that was just a sample. Yeah, yeah. She could do Yeah, that. yeah. Okay. It was a sample. And it wasn't hidden. Don't do me like Should have told you everything you need to know with that little snippet. As a November Scorpio, uh, we don't give a fuck. It's all of y'all. There's no oh, difference. There's a big difference. There's a big difference between October and November. No, there's not. Bookie. Really? Which ones are the annoying ones? November. The October's or November's? November's she probably gonna say she probably gonna say October because she's a November Scorpio. No, the November, November ones is the worst. Really? Mm-hmm. But I think I've only known November ones. What don't you like about them? What do they do? They're hella. Um, they like attention. Extremely. They like to play a victim. Like they, they never can take accountability. It's never them. It's always somebody else. Did you date a Scorpio? I was uh, best friends with one, mm-hmm. and I'd rather drink the seawater. Oh really? Yes. You know everything that's been in that water, you know you sure. Yeah, absolutely. I'd rather have every <laughs> you sure. I'd rather have every disease than be oh, friends with them again. Oh my Even syphilis? God. Everything. What I'm hearing this right now. <laughs> <laughs> like I didn't know it was that bad. Girl. Oh, they're just hella like no. Can we talk about Pisces? Where's the Pisces slander? My mom is a Pisces and oh my god, they get on my nerves. My little sister is one, but she's young and just hella annoying as fuck. So I don't my know. My husband is a Pisces. She February or March? March. Her March. Her birthday is March 13th. My mom is a Pisces. I just go. There's nothing wrong with her. It's a lot, actually. I couldn't have chosen a better partner. Mm. But you know what, though? Whatever zodiac your parent is, sometimes you tend to have aches about them because it's very My parents concerned. are cancers and never again. My parents are Gemini. Yeah, I'm not a fan of cancers. My older sister is a cancer. I'm a but my person. mom is a sensitive cancer and my dad is not. Mm. And I feel like China's not. Uh, she can be. I like the women more than the men. I, I like my dad, but like we could never be together. Well, we can never be together because he's my dad. But I'm just saying, like, <laughs> like if it was a me. male cancer, like, yeah. just no. And my dad be saying the same. He be telling me I would have been dumped your ass. And it's like, I would have did the dumping before you even dumped me. Yeah, so it's you not, don't even have to worry about me. You don't got to worry about that. Because we ain't finna fly. Boop. But he be like, 
He'd be like, your mouth too smart and you and you, uh he got and you gotta stick up your ass. That's what he be telling me. And he like he was like, Your mouth, I would have been left you. It's like you wouldn't even got a chance, Bookie. To even leave me. I do believe Aquarius. As soon as you say we need to talk, yeah, we do. Because I think we need to break up. Period. And then when they be like, oh, I was just going to ask you what you want to No, bitch. And then I just say, oh, just kidding. It was a prank. No, you need to stand on it. So it was a prank. (laughs) No, because I want to be with you. She in November and boy, she just like you said. I'm telling you, them no, really? them them fucking Scorpios. Like at least the women, no, they just they like attention. What is, maybe attention in what kind of way? So you think Chelsea from Love and Boy is a Scorpio? She probably is, or she a Leo for sure. She Let's is. look up her sign. But Leos don't seek attention. We just draw attention because the type of person no. we are. Yeah, no, we seek attention. We like attention. You seek attention. You catfishing people. Y'all like to be. <laughs> we like. They like. Well, I can't say. Damn, I'd be hating to say we because I'm one of them bitches. But we like to be center of attention. Like you want the attention. You be doing so. You everybody can pay attention to you. Okay. Y'all, I like my braids so much better when they're razored. I don't know why. It just looks so much better. Like, Doesn't it? Yeah. at the bottom. Yes, it looks hella neat. And people think, like, it's going to make a blunt edge, but it's not. It just, like, makes it not look... You know when you see people's braids and the ends just look hella scraggly? Mm-hmm. My daughter's a Virgo, Pisces, Gemini, and Capricorn. Mm. The Pisces and the Gemini and the Capricorn is crazy. Yeah, yeah I, don't I don't really much say about Virgo. I don't really fuck too much with Capricorn women no more. Them, but them bitches piss me off, too. Oh, yeah. I do look good, Brie. Okay. My feet stink. They do. You smell them? Mm-hmm. Oh, you don't. Stop saying you smell shit. I really do smell them. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Well, fuck you. <laughs> 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 I'm just going to get the finish Why do you put this shit up? Busted ass ring light. And I take my senior superlative picture tomorrow, so I'm really excited. What is that? It's like what category you pick up voter senior and they win for it. Oh. Um, yeah. Like I worst, um, worst case of senioritis because I come to school like three days out of the week. And out of the three days, I leave early about twice. But my mom been making me go every day lately. That's unfortunate. But I still believe that. My, why the fuck do you be missing school? Because the, the, the people, just the, uh, the smell of school. When I walk in, I want to drop to my knees, sit, and go home. There ain't no point of me being there. I'm done. I just go to get these little grades to graduate. You know, assignments be easy now. The then why are you, you getting care. zeros? Um, well, the zeros because I must have dozed off in class. The day after President's break, I was up to 5 a.m. and then I went to sleep. And I said, Mom, I was up to 5. She said, You're still going to school, so get up. I was dragging to the door and all that. She just was yelling at me, No remorse. So I knew I had to go. But I got that nap in when twice. Did you, when did you take a nap? First period, oh. third period. First period. <laughs> I got that nap in twice. <laughs> but no, since I made honor roll, I've been real happy, confident, you know. Okay, period. But it was just a 3.0. It could have been better. So that's, that's a lot for me. Because I usually don't get on a roll. I'm a 2.0 type person. No, I'm about to whoop you. 2.0 <laughs> no, is two crazy. Point. That's not... You're not even trying. 2.5 to 2.0. No. No. I am trying. I don't have a 3.0. You need to get at least a 3. But I have, I have one. Did you say had or half? I had one uh, quarter two. It was quarter three now. Damn but it, it don't end until this one. Sorry, y'all. My ring light got a short in it. Hold on. Oh, Back in business. Still open. Is it? Who? Oh, Sunday. It might not be. Who's still open? Cheesecake Factory. I want some diet food. The Skinny Licious menu. What? Y'all know they got that Skinny Licious. I ain't never heard of that. It be on the table when you go there, you know? I ain't been to Cheesecake Factory in hella long. You know where I, I just ate Cheesecake Factory today. Day and I was you want a twenty percent off coupon? No way. Yes. Yes way. I have been craving it for months, mm-hmm. and my well, he, oh, man, I'm gonna be my best friend. He, we went. Shut up. Kimaya, okay. just shut up. Kimaya, they still be they still be acting like they together. Anyway, girl, we went to Red Robin yesterday. Oh, um, I ain't been there a hell long. They they got pizza now. Mm-hmm. They got hell of shit. That was so, so wait, so that's good. your ex, but he your best friend. That don't leave no room for y'all to get in a relationship with other people. Say so I might as well be together. Well, we just need some time away. Guys might as well go and cuddle with each other. Hey girl, they still be moving like that together. That's just oh. crazy. 
So he'd be like, where you at? What are you doing? He want to know where you at. No, nah, he would, we ain't never been like that. No, but no, he no, do no. be at, like, last night, he stayed the night. Like, you know. What? Your best friend stayed the night that you used to date? Yeah, we're cool, though. I hope he slept on the couch. relationship where she got to do some explaining. I hope he slept on the couch. All right, that's not for you, too. Okay, see, no. <laughs> Rita, my mom catch up. She probably did. Probably. I'll be making my neck stick. I was about to say, your, your neck can't move? No. You might move your neck, fried Frankie. There you go. Wait. Why are you saying like that? Did you show that shit? Which I, you can get dressed made, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, what are regular? Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. I want to diet. That's me. I'm ready to take this out. Now she on a diet, so she going to get her second mini. Uh, her second mini. I'm weak. I ain't ate the brunch. I'm getting hungry. Mm, 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 oh, mm. but you play clothes this Sunday. That's why you come in on Mondays, bro. You do. You got school Mondays. I don't right. care about them people. No, I care. Them. I care, and I'm not booking you on a Monday, so don't ask. Whatever my 3.0. You that need a 3.5. Mm, I guess I'll be getting Stop doing the bare Sunday. minimum. Do better. I got you this quarter. You That's should be valedictorian, as far as I'm concerned. No, no, I did too bad in 10th grade and 9th grade. Number was on Zoom though. Valedictorian, is it all four years? Okay, Combined so you GPA. You have to have the best GPA all four years. Really? Combined, like, I th- it's probably an average. Yes. Out of the two forty-eight students, I'm literally ranking at like one ninety something. So. Damn. Well, That's overall though. At least you in the middle. One ninety something is not in the middle of two forty-eight. One twenty something is in the middle of two forty-eight. I'm in the back end. Back, back, yeah. You have the back of the bus when Rosa Parks fought for, fought for us. The back of the bus is more fun anyway. Sorry, Auntie Rosa. Mm-mm, get out of here. <laughs> Better luck next time. Thanks, y'all, so much for watching. Oh um, I think I got a client tomorrow I could go live for. I could go live for oh. London. I have London at 6. Bye, y'all. I'll see y'all later. Bye. See you later, It's always a pleasure. Thanks so much for rocking with y'all, and we are out. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, y'all. Not Merry Christmas.